Hello, good morning. Good morning. Hang on, let me just turn this down a sec. There we go, that's better. Right, uh, and then that one. Hey, works. Works. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. Uh, hello, Luca. Good morning. Everyone always watch Luca. She's great. Um, Otpol, hello there. Sorry, my planning's appalling. Uh, Thyrus, my own little Alex Horn. Bless him. And Ducky. Hi, Ducky. God damn, Ducky, what a guy. Um, I hope the Arcadians will appear this stream. Well, they should do because I forced them to spawn. So they should be in here. Uh, should be here somewhere. Uh, right, so. I wanted to play Solaris because I wanted to try out the new Lithoids. And um, I immediately, as Alex who? Little Alex Horn. Uh, right, so there's there's a series called Taskmaster on British TV. And I, I cannot recommend it enough. It's on Dave. It's fucking brilliant. It's got um, Greg Davies as the, the Taskmaster. And basically the idea is that they have these five comedians. And it's like a game show, but like a shit one. And the idea is that they give they give these comedians like um, tasks to do S stuff like get this ball as close to the hole as possible without standing on the big red circle or something like that. And so the idea is that they then do stuff. But little Alex Horn is the tasks ma taskmaster's like little little aid, and he does all the tasks for him. Um, so if you've never watched Taskmaster and you can actually watch it in your country, then do because it's ace resolution looks weird does it what's wrong with the resolution does the resolution look weird it should be all right i think is the text barely readable oh no oh no um maybe if i do that I just, you know what? I have had some. I have had problems with. Um, okay. Uh, maybe what I need to do. This is good, isn't it? This is good. Sorry. Oh no, that one. Um, uh, this. Display capture. Does that look better? Is that readable? Okay, yeah, I think it's... Um, I think it's because Stellaris is a bit weird to, to capture. Um, okay, let's do that. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> okay, God damn it. Okay, that's okay, that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. So what I'll do is I will uh display capture. Yeah, do that. And then hide that. Right. Okay. Does that look better? Is that readable? Tell me, because it looks okay on my screen, but it might not on yours. I'm still feeling about okay. This 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 is this is grade A content right here. Does it does it look okay? Does it look fine? Is this readable? I'll, I'll go with this. Okay. Um, what a start. Uh, <laughs> so I wanted to play the Lithoids. And the first thing that came to mind when they came out was there was this 90s, this 90s cartoon. And I think it was, it was, if you remember the GoBots? Because like they had the Transformers, right? And then you had the GoBots. And the GoBots were like shit Transformers. So because the GoBots were shit, um, they they came out with this this idea for this this new line of, of Transformy things called Rock Lords, and they they were they were like guys 
that turned into rocks, which is literally the worst idea any toy company has ever had. Because it's not that hard, like, just to have things scrunched down into a rock, is it? That That's fairly... And frankly, what's the fucking point in turning into a rock? Like, they just... Like, in the cartoon, they just bounced into each other as rocks. But then they jumped off cliffs as stuff as rocks. Like, what's the fucking point? I mean, admittedly, what's the point in the Autobots turning into, into cars when they can fly as robots? That's... That's a good question. But, realistically, it's probably fine. Well, the thing is, they never used it as, like, go I liked GoBots. Oh, Mikey. Mikey. To be fair, there, there was one particular GoBot, which I did like, and it, like, turned into a flying saucer or something. He was quite cool. Um, but, yeah, let, let's be honest. They, they were rubbish. <laughs> um, so the Rock Lords turned into rocks. That's, that's That was their thing. They turned into rocks, and I, I had... There was, there was one that was, like, a little robot, that turned into like a gold rock, and he was called Nuggets. And I, I had that one, and I actually quite liked him from what I remember. But the rest of them were just a bit. I mean, they, they just turned into rocks. Like, what's the fucking point? So that was fine. But I think one of the best things about it was how half-assed it was, because you had like the Rock Lords, and then you had so they were the good guys, but then you had the evil rock lords like they couldn't even be asked to think of like the bolder tyrants or something they couldn't even be just like fucking evil rock lords that'll do that's it let's, let's let's head to the pub fine ship it done i was three or four okay well that that does i mean a three or four you're not going to be that discerning are you nowadays companies like ea would sell you rocks early access is promise of adding transformation features later wow wow mm. wow okay yes probably Probably is my, my is my chat box working? Should be. Should be okay. I'll I'll just say this. Good, right? Okay, right. So um, so I've made the evil rock lords because let's face it, who wants to be a good guy? Good guys are boring. Um, so I'm authoritarian and also a fanatic militarist. I'm warrior culture and cutthroat politics because from the, it does work. There we go. Thank thank you, little Alex Horn. Um. <laughs> Um, I, I wanted to go with the the raiding ethic, the civic, the the one where you can like raid them, but f frankly, it's terrible. So I went for cutthroat politics instead because I'll like, do. Um, so this is all fine, right? Good. And uh, of course, the, the the home planet of the Rock Lords was Cortex, Quartz, Quartzix, because because why not? Gonna be lazy with the names. I mean, uh, to, to be fair, some of the names for the, the Transformers were pretty lazy as well. Um, okay, good. So, Yifa Up Canoe. Hello. How is your canoe? You are. Okay, let's. Um, I'm gonna send you out. We're gonna send you out. I, I need to do some research as well. In fact, what I what I tend to do, I haven't played this in so long. What we got? Okay, we, that's good. That's good. Meh. Um, Oh, we could get another... Mono okay, let's... Let's go to the market. Let's sell some crap, because we don't need it. And then we will go back here. We will recruit the maniacal guy. He then... Right, good. So, I like research. I really like research. Um, this is all trash. I guess mining station... Sure, it's the cheapest one. Let's do that. So we've got two greens and one red rock doing some research. Good. The chat, this patch must be burnt to ashes alongside EA. That's just not true. It's fine. It's A-OK. -okay. okay, so we've got... Oh, we need... We need another science ship, don't we? Need a science ship. Um, I kind of wanted to go with an Arctic world because it looks better with the with the rocks. I wish maybe the, the like the, the city changed colours depending on your empire colour. That would be nice. Oh well. No problem. Um so we eat rocks, don't we? That's that's fun. Wow, we've got loads of lithoid monoliths and we we can make I I guess because their population is so slow. Their population growth is so slow, it kind of gives you extra pops to kind of be getting on with. In Prosperous Mesa, okay. This is this is all good. This is fine. This this is good times. Okay, great. 
Uh, we've got a science ship building. That's fine. Let's build some mining stations. Crack on, I guess. No, that's the wrong way. That way. There we go. Um, underling Allah. Okay. Good old Underling Allah. I do you find it amusing the rock people eat rocks? I mean, I, I guess we eat meat. So we're made of meat. We eat meat. I guess that's fine. Uh, good. Construction queue. Science ship. That's what we wanted. And where is... That's it. Hema. You were terrible as a scientist. So now you're going to go and visit a black hole. Hope you don't run into anything nasty out there. Good luck. Hope I'll be able to get back to Star soon. I need more lithoids in my life. What's the difference to humans eating monkey meat? Or any meat, indeed. I mean... Really? I do get your point, though. I mean, theoretically, they could be eating themselves. But then so could we. Frankly, it's a bit of a disturbing thought. And now suddenly it is gargantua or you are the horizon signal. Yes. Oh, hello. The Grunur. Uncovered remains. Ancient spacefaring race. Blah, blah, blah. Grunur disappeared. Blah, blah, blah. Fine, whatever. Okay. Discovered an archaeological site. Nice. Love a bit of, love a bit of archaeology. And apparently we found alien remains and our people find that fucking hilarious. So good for them. I mean, I guess anything goes on Cortex. Anyone's good for a giggle. Stop ruining my... Sorry, Ducky. Stop ruining my emotion. <laughs> uh, happens for word survey? Yep, sure. Knock yourself out. I mean, sure. Why not? What's that? Yep, good. Keep, keep going. Where are you going? You going over there? Sure. Sure. Keep surveying. Keep surveying. Keep surveying. Find strange new worlds and stuff. Good. Could I get an... Exp of course you can, Luca. I forgot you can rename people. Um... I'll make you this. Oh, how do I how do I rename people? Is it it's this and then? Oh, wait. How? What? How do I? How? 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 Here? No. Luca, tell me what how I do this thing. How do the thing? Leader tab. Click on name. Ah, good. Thank you. Right, good. I'm 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 smart. S M T. Uh, it's that one. Isn't it? There we go. Look, uh, Grenur. Are they good? I forgot what they are. Like, I'm fairly sure I've done both of the new ancient people things, but precursors. Hello. One of the small moonlets orbiting has been identified as a problem. Okay, well, good. I mean, that's basically why we found a big lump of food floating in space. Mm -mm -mm. Tasty. Tasty, tasty food. Ah, do we want more mines? I guess we do. Let's just build a mine. Let's not that out. Let's get crack on with it. Just Ascension's End. The little... A little barren world. A precious moon. More energy. Oh, okay. Well, that's good, I guess. Once with a new bowel life seeding, instant Gaia world, just add water. Oh, that thing. I mean, that's kind of not as useful for us because I think we have like a 50% increase to... Um, what you call it? What you call it? What, what do I call it? Habitability, that's the word for living on things. Right, okay. Uh, look, I, I kind of want expansion. Do you want to go expansion? Or discovery? Mm, so, I mean, surveying is is super important early on. Hmm. <sighs> hmm. Do I want to go? Remember, remember, every pop on a Gaia world has. Oh, do they? Ah, devouring swarm of is instant new, new. Oh my God, Luke, that's horrendous. Expansion is my. I'm. I'm, I'm kind of looking at expansion. I mean, our pop growth is already quite slow, so maybe boosting it up. But discovery is... is the spe thing is, we can kind of cover discovery by just building a shit ton more science ships. Fuck it, I'm going expansion. 
I'm gonna expand. I'm expanding rock. Star system charted. Well, that was, that was boring, wasn't it? I thought you were gonna die horribly over there, but nope, you're fine. Okay, well, I guess you're gonna go over here now. How's the money doing? Okay, we can get more science ships. That's what we're doing. More science ships, more scientists. Uh, do I want to grab that? Don't think it's worth it. Construction complete. Don't think it's worth it. What we can do is get a new scientists. Uh, you, you're resilient. You'll live longer. Sure. That works. Ben W. Marshall, thank you very much for the follows. Uh, let's send you over here. Let's go and help out with the, the survey. Hi, Ben. Then go discovery early on to give. That I kind of was thinking that I, I normally go discovery but I, I'm kind of like I'm I was kind of like well should I should I go for something so I've, I've, I've gone for that but I don't know I, I tend to go for discovery the same normally go discovery or expansion finished yeah I, I, I quite like discovery because you can like get a lot of oh god we're at negative money already uh sure research it Negative money. I mean, it's not the end of the world, but it's fine. Normally go expansion, discovery. Okay, discovery first and expansion, 90%. Yeah, discovery and expansion tend to be like the early ones, don't they? Like, there's, there's no point going for, like, supremacy early on, because the likelihood of you fighting a war is so, so remote. So, to be honest, by the time I've... Finish. I mean, this this is six hundred. Is it six hundred stars? I thought it was six hundred. It looks like nine hundred to me. I'll count them. One, two, three. F no, never mind. I won't do that. Uh, despite the toxic content, that's me. And high pressure, that's also me. What's this? Environmental engineer. Okay, good. Uh, the planet's atmosphere. Strong. Okay, sure. Go and have a look in the toxic atmosphere. I take it that's planet YouTube. That's not fair. My YouTube's actually very nice. My YouTube comments are 99%. Very, very nice. Uh, meant to ragged planes of shadow. Okay, that one. Did, okay, this one always weirds me out because it's like sheets of organic material drifting through the upper layers of the atmosphere, hinged or rather jointed to allow for a small... De like, at that... What? What the fuck is that? Like, if I got a report on my desk that went, yeah, we found massive sheets of, like, skin floating through space... Or th floating through the atmosphere of this planet. The first thing I'd go would be like... And? What what the fuck's going on there? Don't just like... I wouldn't go, fine, whatever. That's just... I'll just throw that on the pile of things to look at later. Fuck me. Supremacy is more useful in the mid-late game. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. One of those things I tend to get last is one of the Federations since I never used... Yeah, I, I don't use Federations. Although, that the new, the new DLC does look interesting. I might actually be interested in Federations then. It's hard to imagine life uh, endless sea of silicite particles. And yet, I mean, we're literally rocks, guys. Lit we're literally... <laughs> sure. Um, although toxic to most forms of known life, Agenda 2 supports a thriving... Where is this? Down here. Okay, fascinating. How do I name a system? I want to name the system. Is it this one? This one. Okay, I can name this, can I? Fucking. How, 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 can I? Can I? Oh, I can't name a system I don't own, can I? Fuck. Okay, I need to own that and name it System YouTube. When you get bonuses or penalties, depending on whether you join or do not join the Galactic community. Yeah, see, that sounds quite fun. That sounds quite fun. And then once you're really dependent on it, you can leave. That'll be good. Um, exotic gases. Exotic gases is fun. I want this. Although, I would prefer a planet with more districts on it. At least more better districts. You know what I mean. Uh, reach up for the stars. Inf yeah, sure, we'll get that. We'll grab that. And I guess we'll grab this because I do want to, I do want to do some digging. 
do some digging. I got myself some hot chocolate this morning because, I mean, two reasons. One, it's horrible outside. It's pissing it down with rain. And it's, it's like that rain where the wind's so strong that occasionally you get that blasts of, like, rain rattling your window. <laughs> and the other reason was I couldn't get to the coffee machine because there was too much crap in the kitchen. So, um, you know, but... Why don't you just take over the universe? I mean, that that's obviously, you know, eventually the plan. Uh, but uh, you can leave, yes. But I got that you suffer some heavy penalty if you do so. You can have a destroy the organization. <laughs> uh, so many things I could say about that. Um, shifting sands. Okay, what's this do? Oh, apparently there's some weird shit down there. Good. Well, I wasn't even paying attention to where that was. Not important. Weird, creepy meat monsters. Ugh. Monsters made out of meat? That sounds horrendous. Ick. They're all squishy. Oh, what's this? Size... F Ooh. Size 15 does well. Sounds like every day in Scotland. <laughs> and one of the things the Galactic Wonders were really downgraded when they nerfed it a bit. Um, I mean, they're still good. But they're pretty much something you build, like, after you've won, I find. Uh, yeah, sure, go and knock yourself out. Knock yourself out, buddy. Let's do that. Uh, you're going over there. I guess let's head in this direction. Uh, significant scarring on the surface, sure. Do your busy work. The Ascension perk. Uh, oh, the oh, the essential perk galactic wonders. Oh, um, what does that do now? The scorching heat of it, the science bit range. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, sure, whatever. Uh, uh, no, it's not edicts. Oh fuck, I forgot to do that. I could do map the stars. Let's do map the stars. Let's do map the stars. Uh, can I see what it was? Galactic wonders. So you get. Ring world, matter decompression, and dice and spear research op options. I mean, personally, I, I, I'd like a f I mean, there, there is a mod that adds more um, traditions, isn't there? I quite like more ascension perks, personally. Dice and spear and matter are just not useful if you ask me. Really? I, I thought they made, like, gave you, gave you all the good, good stuff. Do they not give you all the good stuff? How do you bench monsters? Mostly by lying on them. Quite a bit more useful. Mm, I don't know. I mean, to, to be honest, I tend to... By the time I get to the mega structures, I tend to have won anyway. Just one of those things. Uh, right, let's go and grab that. We can do some digging down there. Yeah, so I, I thought like the Dyson Spheres were quite useful because they give you like a shit ton of energy. I guess if you get like the what am I thinking of? The ec economic ec big planet city planet. If you get the Coruscant shifting sands, blah 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 blah. Liquid sands, good. Sure. What's that? Is this this one? Liquid sands, shifting sands. Okay, good. Is that good? Doesn't look good. Light show. We can use that technology. Give me blue lasers. Uh, I'm already researching, so don't worry about that. Star system okay, this has got some. Uh, no, it's got. Okay, it's got generator. It's got food. I don't need food. Found. What's this? Hang on. What are you telling me? Briefly, take some unusual. Right. Well, yeah. Go and look at it. Don't don't come and talk. To, like gods. It reminds me of the um, research station. Yes. That's why I said, Echinopopopopolis. That one. Uh, MA doesn't lift. He just do a snarky comment about how much Grimgore would um, would have like stomping that thing. Damn right. I want. I once went to the gym. Um, I got lost. I tell you what. I, I I should go back to the gym. I should do. I should do. I don't want to, but I should do. I'm not one of those people that particularly enjoys it. Is there going to be a Total War stream today? No, sorry, Snoop. I, I'm going to stream again on Monday. But this was very much like uh, my wife was going out for coffee with a friend this morning. And I was like, wait, that gives me uh, that gives me some time. I can stream. 
Uh, bunker bots. Trace the unusual electromagnetic radiation emanating from Rabinok 1 to a secret subterranean bunker hiding a mega computer the size of a battleship. Which we don't currently have. Um, scrap it for parts. Boost research. Let it continue. You know what? I, I might just let it continue for the influence. It seems important. Yeah, let's let it go. I want more influence. Perfect excuse to play games. Exactly. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> Hi, Soapy Muffins. Uh... On the way or in the gym itself? I mean, from column A, level. No, I, I did. I did once join a gym, um, but I oh, fucking hated it. What's this? Efforts to map? Sure, knock yourself out. Um, it's just like some people like get a real like they love the gym. They get a real high from it. I go there and hate my life. Imperious punishment. Hi. I just. I'm just not. A, I'm just not a gym person. I'm more of a sitting on my ass person. That's that's more me. That is more me. Um, do I want to colonise this yet? It's just I I kind of need re I need I need raw resources, and uh, that's not going to give me the raw resources that I need. So maybe I go and grab. I can grab this one. Let's do that. Let's do that. Oh, do we have a spare pop? No, I've got an available job. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Maybe it's just like me. <laughs> uh, bought this game with all the DLC last weekend. Have to have yet to give it a go. Oh, it's really good. It's got its issues, but it's it's really good. Uh, I looked. At I looked again, I forgot to mention that Gaia Worlds give a 10% happiness to all non-machines. Ah, I once paid for six months gym membership, went two times, never looked back. <laughs> I I went, I paid, I was paying monthly, and the thing is, it was like, it was like 30 quid. And I only went like once a week. I went on a Saturday, because I couldn't, I, you know, I get, I get home from work, I can't be asked to go after work. I mean, I can't be asked to go on a Saturday, to be honest. But I'd go in, and I'd do the... The, the working out and I would get sweaty and tired and then basically just go this is awful so why why was I paying 30 quid a week a month to to do that uh what's this back scattering spectrometry sensors indicate don't stop talking to me nerd just research it star base upkeep reduced that sounds quite nice um let's get colonization fever because that'll probably be quite useful so let's do that I spent three days a week, one hour each time. It took me ages to get into the routine, but got there. Uh, see, I quite, I don't mind swimming. I'm just terrible at it. It's like, at best, I'm the, the best you can say about my swimming is that I'm buoyant. I, I, I perform the same function as the hull of a boat. That's that's about everything you can say about me. The other thing could have helped your energy income. What thing? What did I do? What happens? Who do? Woof. Eh? What did, what, did, what did I do? What did I do? What did I do? What did I do? I forgot. I've forgotten already. <gasps> Shit. The tradition. Oh. Oh, yes. No, you're right. Well, I guess. God, 13 point. Jesus. Really? It would have. I mean, it would have made me have, lose no money, I suppose. It's fine. It's all right. It's okay. We'll get, we'll get it next. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. No one panic. Ancient survey marker. More minerals. Lovely. I'll take those minerals. Do we have the right to call anyone nerds? These scientists are nerds. Look at them. Look at their faces. That wait, not that one. Um, that one. look at them. Nerds. Nerds. Definitely a nerd. You wait, see the way his head floated away from the rest of his body. Nerd. I don't even know what that, that was. Research it. Gigantic skeleton. That's very spoopy. Try not to be scared. Why you look at the skeleton? Uh, rock potential, except exceptionally rich in minerals. Minerals that are unfortunately no use to us. Have a scientist officer blah 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 blah. blah, blah. Um, what? Positron bombardment. Well, oh, I want to bombard it. Hang on, I'll do it. I can I can sell I'll sell microwaves. Bop. Oh come on, come on. Oh, okay, no wait. 
What's this? Oh, hello. Lunchtime, boys. That looks good. We're doing that. We're getting that. Uh, society research. That's good. Pop. Uh, yeah, we need pop growth, don't we? So let's get pop growth. Let's do that. Doctor's orders that I was way overweight and have a bad heart. We don't want to reach, uh, want to reach 50. I need to do something. Great motivator. That's fair. Yeah. Uh, I do love the fact that Luca asked me nicely if she could be a scientist. Then made it all nerd. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's harsh, isn't it? Hey, I am a nerd. I wonder if my empire will be friendly to you or it will be seek to conquer the galaxy. Um, they are beautiful. Fuck it. Give me engineering research. Where is Luca? There's Luca. Luca Muck Luca face. There you are. Now I know where you are. Uh, good. Right, technology. Physics. Nice. I'll take that. More research speed. That sounds good. Why are you not using the Lithoid announcer? Oh, because it's it sounds awful. Is that just me? Oh, we can change we can change it. I was like, oh god, that sounds it's just it's just puns. Like I don't mind that, but my immersion. Uh where is it? It's uh, Vice, there we go. Um, oh, fuck's sake. Fucking hell. Alright. Like, I just... I, it, like, I, I... Okay, I want, to, I want to rename this system to YouTube. YouTube Comments. Because YouTube Comments 2 has ammonia biosphere. That's right, it's a toxic world. And uh, that's where it is. Good. Based it. Fucking amazing. Um, good. I need... Right, I need more energy. Oh, I, I've got loads of energy. That's fine. Okay, in that case, two science ships. Education, education, education. Um, I'm also a nerd, but it's just... The spider may put into it. <laughs> nerd! Nerd. Uh, let's get Trod. You're up. Uh, let's send you in this direction. Somewhere over here. Let's go over there. There we go. Good. Good, good, good. Shame they don't have a Wurzag announcer. They do have a... a I think they use some voices from like... Uh, there, there is an Orc announcer. There's probably mods for that. There is indeed. Uh, apparently Luca likes biology. What a nerd. In fact, that's got to be that's got to be weird, hasn't it? Because like we're fucking rocks. So she's like, oh, that meat stuff. That looks interesting. I like the way it squidges. I like to prod it. It's just weird, Luca. Like, I don't like to kink shame, but... Ugh. Um, as soon as you're all garbage, I'm going to get the cheapest one. Well, no, the, the youngest one. I'm, I'm age discriminating. But uh, tough. <laughs> Does that make Luca a heretic? Maybe. Right, let's excavate. It sounds a bit Optimus Prime, doesn't it? The, the voice, I think. Uh, volatile moats. What's this? We found a thing. What is it? Strange flows. Well, it should be a normal molten planet making the science ship sensors glitch uncontrollably. Further studies advised. Where's that? Over there. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Bamboozle Ballet. Thank you for the follow. Uh, is she just the rock version of a geologist? Oh, I guess she would be, yeah. She would be. Um, my, my old boss used to... He was a geologist. I used to call him a nerd because he had a load of rocks that he kept. And I told him he was adorable. And he gave me like a long sigh every... Mind you, he's also the one where I took a, a pack of googly eyes I got off Amazon and then just stuck them around his office in places he wouldn't notice right away. Um, so occasionally I just hear a, God damn it! As he found like a, his, his board pen had some googly eyes on it or something. It was amazing. Um, endless. Um, that's probably why I got made redundant, to be honest. Love your welcome message under info. <laughs> Imperious punishment. Thank you for the follow. Um, you should upgrade your planet. I will. I'll get around to it. Now we know why the budget was going to be laid off. <laughs> 
<laughs> exactly. Uh, sure. Hello, weird bird monsters. This changes everything. What are they? Uh, okay, they're, they're, they're the ones that don't care if I get up cozy with them. That's fine. Okay, let's research. What is that? Savannah world could be useful. What's over here? Oh, that's the mineral world that I want. We want that one. That'll be a good one. Um, planet. Yeah. The um, thing is, I don't have the people for it. So... Uh, that That is a point, though, because what I could do is... Uh... Abandoned amusement park. Intrigue. How do I do the thing? This one. Um, right. So let's... Let's knock down the lithoid monoliths, and that'll give us more... More mo rock monsters. That's good. What's this? Cursory scan of planet reveals a weak signal pulsing into the dark. Oh, well, yeah, sure. Look at the pulsing signal if you really want to. Don't let me stop you. Okay, well, that's kind of useful because they they kind of act as a border for us. Although they might block us in, but it depends. Uh, energy. Oh, hello. Greetings, evil rock lords. You know that note? We, whatever the fuck you are, are dedicated to studying conversation of, of converse... Com 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 we, we like watching people of all forms of life in the galaxy. We study blah, 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 blah. Um, okay, should I... I mean... Should I give them some rock, some of our rock people? Just do it. Virus says we need to give some of our evil rock lord pops to... It's better to have them as friends. Is it? I say we just declare war on them and see what happens. Well, we've got two very opposing views there. <laughs> also spies. Evil. Okay, you can have your contribution. And we've got our border. Okay, they've opened the border, so that's, that's useful. And Okay, I mean, sometimes these guys will give you stuff. Which can be really useful. So, I think that's worth a pop. Oh, do I want to go over here? I kind of do. Let's go over here. Oh, no. You know what? Let's go over here because... Because there's a planet there which I want to colonise. Throw a space cracker at them. They look like parrots. We need more energy. Ah, oh, it's fine. I can just sell some microwaves. It's all good. Oh, okay. I'll check the anomaly in a sec. Um, right, let's... Oh, pop growth speed. Yeah, I want pop growth speed. I'm doing it. What was this anomaly? Uh, foreign alien-made objects. All right. Knock yourself out. Ooh. Uh, decoded ancient data crystals have been found at the dig site, chronicling the Grenur's military exploits. While most are local and of little interest, several volumes detail the Grenur's first encounter with an alien species referred to as the Bowel Organism. Little more could be gleaned about the bowel at this point, save that they were a massive plantoid species and had many colonies seeded among the stars. Keep digging. Keep digging, nerd. Oh, Luca, Luca, Luca face. Uh, research the anomaly. Limbo? Okay. Something about people in a thing, is it? Something like that. It's fine. I'll worry about that in a sec. Uh, goods. Good, good, good. Good, good. Right, we're knocking stuff down. We got well, we got no pop because oh geez, that was quick. Grenur ruins. Tempers are running high at the archaeology site on Akaramalo one, and several archaeologists are openly disagreeing with Patel up law about how best to proceed. Progress size so oh brilliant. Good good job, nerd. Um is that days, months? Days. Yeah, it's days. Whiff of something. Apparently we found a box. Small perforations. It smells. Good. A smelly thing. Lovely. Uh, right, so let's... Already had it open. Let's knock down some of these. Get some more pop. Maybe the parrots will give us something pretty... Uh, more more mines, that's good. Let's get production targets, because that's our food as well. 
Uh, the government must be real alien to the evil rock lords. Trees with brains. Like, it's just creepy. Like, meat's one thing, but... Ugh. Um, I want this. So let's go and build an outpost over there. What are you doing? You are not doing anything. Is, wait, where's Luca? Luca McLuca face? It's that one, isn't it? Okay, you're there. You're... Th oh, okay, do that. Do that. I thought it was I thought it was Luca, but no, it's, she's over there. Luca's over there. Level one mage. Oh shit! I found an MB stream. Rejoice! Rejoice indeed. Uh, faction founded. Landscape of the oh, the political landscape of the evil rock lords. They're by scientist Luca. They call themselves the Glory Initiative. Luca, what are you up to? Um, and Emperor Magmar is the one throne group. Uh, star patterns. I'll worry about that in a sec. Uh, <laughs> Lucas leaving the militarist faction. I mean, that, that scans. MA stream, can't spell too that acronym, Jesus Christ. Ah, it's close enough. I mean, it's only one one letter out, wasn't it? It's fine. Um, pulsing stars. Yeah, let's, let's have a look at some pulsing stars. Okay, I want another... Do I want... So oh, a bi what's, wait, what's this? Oh. A bioreactor. That's interesting. That's interesting. Hmm. Um, uh, problem is I need more energy, so I think I've got to do this. I think I've got to do that. Uh, you know, Devouring Storm is my first place. Exactly, that's what I was, that was what I was thinking. Have you, oh, she's just going door to door. Have you heard the word about our glorious devouring swarm? Uh, okay, right, a whiff of something. Box is indeed a document of a sort. Scientist officer Paul Dunpon admits that they've been hoping for a historical record of some other kind. Codex significant, blah, blah, blah. Some sort of comedy based on smell. Um, good. Lovely. Good, good. Right, let's, uh, let's, get, let's get surveying. Gotta earn that. Gotta earn that dollar with the surveys. Let's get all that done. Anyone else not doing anything? No, everyone else is happy. Lovely. R right. Research. We're going to colonize. What? Encounter in Gindix. Okay, sure. Where? Over there. What have you found? What do your elf eyes see? Oh, it's a, like a it's a ball of glowing shit. Lovely, great. That's that's fun. Okay, let's colonize. Oh, it's only seventy percent, but that's actually fine. So yeah, knock yourself out. Chuckle fox. Hello. And they called Luca a nerd. And Luca Science went to the army and started a research program. That's how Wolfenstein started. <laughs> oh God, yeah. Did I say nerd? I meant valued employee. Uh, gene clinics. I mean, that's more pop growth, which we do kind of need. Month of unity. Uh, let's get month of unity. The gene clinic. I don't think actually the, the gene clinics are actually that useful. I seem to remember that they're actually a little bit. Um, they're not. They don't actually do that. Um, they, they take a long time to pay for themselves. A ruined network of Aristat colony, uh, colonies dating back to at least three millennia can be found in the low orbit of the gas giant. Okay, good. Oh, you, you got sad, didn't you? Because there was baddies. There was a glowing ball and you just got upset. So now you're over here basically being a pain in the ass. Okay, go and, go and have a look at all that. Let me know how it goes. Let's build some mining stations there. Instead of a Dark Lord, you would have a queen. That is correct. A queen with a big, big angular head. Apparently. I always think I should, like, build ships early on, and then I never do. And then inevitably, it's always the last thing I ever do. Uh, Anthropod hers. Navigate. Okay, sure. Oh, it's been fully excavated. Good times. 
Uh, data crystal recording the reveal that the Grenur waged war against the Baal, desiring the plentiful resources purportedly found on their planets. Such a system coordinates has been successfully extracted from one such record. Sure, let's let's go and have a look. Let's go and have a look, see if we can find the horrible, gross, squidgy plant monsters. Oh, two oh hello. Hello, Daddy. That's that's fine. Um Don't even need jewelry, you are a jewel. So so because I've got Squidge now, I call myself Daddy quite a lot. And that's fine. In, until you refer to yourself as Daddy to, to some to someone else when you don't have Squidge around. Then it's weird. And uh, I've, I've, I've done that a bit too much recently. Um, despite the promises of riches suggesting the ancient Grenur data crystals recovered from Acromalo, Bunda 2 is a dry, barren world, void of atmosphere. Fortunately, the geological stands reveal a near endless trove of fossilized remains deep in the planet's sedimentary record. Among them is a planetoid species, most likely to have been the Baal. It's the only one identified in possession of the neurological structures required for sapience. A targeted excavation should uncover more information. Excavate away, MA the Pimp Daddy. Helm Bearer, hello. Eh, I'm easy. Me too. Uh, oh god, that's that's a bit... Can't have you spending two years just looking at some weird dusty crap on a planet. Jesus Christ. We've got stuff to do. Stuff to do. People to see. Um, people are unemployed. Do I go... Yeah, let's do that. We're doing that. It's going to cost us some microwaves, but I don't care. It says microwaves. Like, are they, is this? I guess it's supposed to be like a box of stuff. It kind of looks like a sofa to me. Always makes me think that I'm making sofas. Uh, research speed five percent. Good. That's nice. I do need more energy. Let's do that. Let's go for that. And monster band. Hello, Helm Bearer. Um, things, things to see, people to do, and all that. Exactly. Ancient orbital shipyard drifts in silence above this world. It suffered significant battle damage, and entire sections of facility are missing. Three hundred days. Jesus. All right. God. I mean, that's, that's a lot of tea breaks, isn't it? Uh, derelict space station trapped in a slow terminal orbit inside the atmosphere of this gas giant. Where is that? Over there. Um, the gravitational stressors will likely destroy it completely within the next thousand years. It has not yet drifted deep enough to the atmosphere to make archaeological expedition to the station impossible. Okay. That works. I'm, I'm all for that. Did we have a colony? Oh, we do have a colony ship going. Good. Good, good, good. And uh, let's go over here and get some more energy because we need more energy. Because I like... Look, look. Seven energy. There's two actually over there. I should probably grab that as well. Um, energy at the moment. Not actually, not actually too bad. Not actually too bad. And minerals is good. So let's knock down some more monoliths. And then we can get more peeps. And they can go and work as scientists. That's right. We're going to knock it down. Harass them. Wake them up. Shake them awake. Stick them in a lab coat. Or whatever our rock monsters have in instead of lab coats. How long is a galactic year in this game? Uh, it's well, it, it's basically the current calendar. So there's 12 months, and I think 31 days in each month, or 30 days in each month. And so then, it, so we've been we've been going for 14 years now. Uh, what's this? Something moves with near purpose down on Barusus. Okay, go nerd it up, boys. Automated shipyard, nice. Okay. Ah, oh, the first evil rock lords colony. That's good. Nice little colony for the evil rock lords. Rock monsters. Yep, yeah, damn right. Uh, we briefly detected some unusual readings. Sure. Any relation to rock lobsters? I mean, there's there's probably some some distant relation there. Oh, okay, you go survey that one, and then go and survey that one. Actually, this is a nice little cluster here, isn't it? Like, if we could grab, like, this system, that would be really good. We could be in a really good position here. 
This never happens to me. I always end up with some like mass. Like I, I usually end up sandwiched between horrible alien races who want to eat my face. Uh, let's go for galactic ambition because that's going to reduce our upkeep. Hopefully, pre sapient species where. Uh, large amount of ship debris, sure. Oh, crystal caverns. Oh, can we... S uh, what are they? Oh, I have to go to... Species. No? Is it because they're not in my empire? Hmm, maybe it doesn't show me. I don't know. Um, but I'm... The rock star. <laughs> uh, to be fair, I like that idea. Name all the planets after rock stars. That was my second idea. After, um, after uh, to be honest, I should have I should have looked at what the what the rock lords were called, but I think they were all boring names. Um, approaching Kepler three, the E R L Pafutum suddenly received a glancing hit by several passing mass drive arounds. Projectiles were billions of years old, and based on the trajectory that they appeared to stray round, fired from neighbouring galaxy. After missing their intended target, they continued on their journey for untold millennia. Until today, the rounds are recovered are of ancient, uh, of an advanced design, despite their incredible age. Fun times. Good. Right. Um, so, minerals is fine. Energy is okay. Sofas is a little bit low. We could do with more sofas. We could maybe do with some more unity. I'm tempted to go more sofas because it's always something I struggle with. So we're going to make more sofa. We're going to make a, a DFS. Make more DFS. Uh, rock Halford, Rock Zombie. What's this? On the surface of a large machine. Okay, good. Oh, did we do a thing? Are you bored now? Wait, what's going on? Uh, thick layers of ash, a notable mass extinction event in the geological records coincide with the material previously extracted from gr the Grunner data crystal, suggesting the Grunner firebombed Brunder 2 with a gelling incendiary roughly 7 million years ago. Widespread deforestation of the planet's surface disrupted local ecosystems and lack of oxygen fi uh, fixing vegetation gradually depleted the planet's atmosphere over the next 60,000 years. Unfortunate. I, I, I should cocoa. Rocky Balboa. <laughs> These are all good. I can name my scientists. Um, oh, that's Luca. We can't rename Luca. I'll, I'll rename the science ship. Rocky. Uh, Bal. Boa. I like this idea. Aussie Rock Swarm. Amazing. Aussie Rock Born. Uh, what else we got? Rock Halford. And. Rock. <laughs> Rocker Downey Jr. All our science ships have the best names in the world. One of these worlds. Riffraff the scientist. I felt like... Good to hear. Uh, let, oh, hello. Signs of battle. Clear evidence of a massive space battle took place. Blah, 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 blah. Sure. Alien machine. Further scans suggest the machine is still operational, though its purpose remains entirely unclear. Science officer Hima Tal Gun has never seen anything like it. Some of the materials look familiar, but the, where is this? Okay, it's a Cap Kapler. Now, the machine has what appears to be a console with one item in particular standing out. A large crooked lever of unknown material. I mean, obviously, pull the lever. 
As the scientists pulled the lever, the machine emitted a huge blast of energy that multiplied in shockwaves, twisting and rippling through the void, tearing open a wormhole in Bununda. Where? Oh. Right there. Um, after the residuous energy diffused, the wormhole and the immediate area around it settled and now appear to be stable if a safe passage. Ooh. Hey, strange. Now take it apart. Intriguing. Research the machine. Um... Am I going to get over there? I like I want the research on the planet, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to like expand that far because I kind of want to grab this. So I might just take it apart. Sure, let's do that. Maybe I will get over there, but I might not. Okay, now we've got a wormhole. That's fun. Pull in the lever. Pull the lever, Kronk. I said we name our military fleets other metals. We're crystals, though. We're like crystal people. Uh, where's a uh, ship, ship designer? Look, see? Don't we look glorious? Look at this. Holy shit. Look amazing. It's a lovely pinky. Lovely pinky colour. Uh, an abandoned ship has been left to drift aimlessly. Blah blah blah. Sure. Oh, did I not? Was I not received? What? What? Did we just research that? And I wasn't paying attention. Um, let's. Offboard Trading Company is far. I mean, none of these are particularly good. Um, I guess leader pool size is kind of nice. I grab that one. It's not my preference, but uh, we'll do it. Let's build some mining stations there. And sensors pick up unexpected activity. Sure. Let's grab that boy, bad boy. And uh, what do you make weapons out of? Metal. We have minerals. I mean, that's that's a good point, I guess. What's this? Arid world. Bleak. An abandoned solar sail ship in orbit around Orim 1. The supply vessel was built in an unknown culture and appeared to be several thousand years old. One of the massive sails has a large tear in it. Interesting, albeit primitive design. Survey complete. Excellent. So that's going to give us more energy, which is good. Salty. Goes to its uh, blah blah blah. They found some salt or something that gives us more happiness, which is good. And anomaly extensive probing. You know how I feel about probing. Probe away. Knock yourself out, guys. Oh, we don't have amenities. Did that expire? It did. Um. Oh, I kind of want to do the health. Well, do we get a? So we can't... Okay, so we don't have the... We don't have the ability to... Increase our pop growth, which is a bit punishing. Never mind. I guess, I guess this is fine. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. Sure, sure, sure. Sure, sure, sure. I want... I need more... Hello. Militant... Oh, oh, hello. Pitiful creatures. Know that we roam the stars for eons before your hapless species mastered spaceflight. If any of your wretched little ships cross into our space, do not expect them to return. Respect... Uh, authority. Oh, you're right over there. Lovely. I mean... I guess that means it's all safe because no one's going to be travelling through the space. On the other hand, it does mean if there is a um, a war in heaven, guess who's going to be right in the fucking middle of it? This is why you build the gene clinics. I, I, I've always heard the gene clinics are a bit naff. Like people are going, ah, gene clinics, who needs them? But now I'm thinking I probably should should do the gene clinics. Um, so the ERL Aussie Rockborn gained a new... Okay, we can gain a scientist or we can get extra research speed and discovery chance. I think they do good work where they are. Okay, Luca. Let's see if we're entirely boxed in or what. 
So you're going to go out there. Construction ship. Uh, let's get some research going on. I mean, this isn't too bad. Uh, before we develop faster light travel, several sublight exploration probes were dispatched from Quart, Quart 6 at near relativistic speeds towards nearby systems. The scientists who developed the probes uh, naively included sensitive information about our culture in their memory cores as a form of greeting to alien civilizations. It's having realised that this data could potentially be used against us. We need to track down these probes before they are found by someone or something unsympathetic to our species. Okay. Um, so... Where is it? Sublight probes. There we go. Okay. I want to... Not track all of them. Track that one. There we go. Right. Okay. Okay. That's not actually... Some type... Like, I, I was expecting one to end up in the middle of this. these guys. Then I'd be like, well, I won't be able to find that until the end, end game. But it's fine. Um, completely surrounded by others who want you dead? Is this another orc campaign? That, that would be ironic, wouldn't it? Xenophiles leave you um, alone, and xenophobes do not care as long as you don't enter their territory. This is true, or build next to it. In which case they'll go, what the fuck are you doing? And uh, what the pun you... <sighs> Production targets, which is good. Uh, let's get the uh, minerals from jobs. I quite like that idea. Uh, briefly detect... What's this? Developed a new skill. What do you like? What skill? Who? What are you doing now? Oh, you're carefree. Okay, good. Knock yourself out. Not literally. What was I planning to do? I had a plan, and then I forgot it when the bad pun came up. Nope, forgot. Never mind. I'll worry about it later. It's fine. Um, I really don't have many planets with good mines. Oh, well, that's quite a lot of... Mm. I mean, considering we're, we're... To be honest, I can probably grab this later. Because there's, like, no one up here. So I probably want to head in this direction first. Um, so let's grab this one. How's my cohesion? Okay, we're fine. We're fine. It is all good. Um, oh god, yeah, we need more housing. Let's build some more housing. It's all good. And uh, Kaid Prime is... Uh, we'll get two pops there as well, which is really useful. That's going to give us a bit of a boost to start off with. Oh, I know what I wanted to do. I wanted to... Because at some point we're going to need to fight something. So, uh, let's... Let's do that. Let's get a new general. Who should we get? Resilience. Adaptable. Trickster. I mean, combat disengagement chance is quite nice. Especially for corvettes. Uh, let's get you. I'm going to call him The Rock. Good. Lovely. Um, did you get two fallen empires your closest neighbours? Yes. It's Admiral, not General. Well, basically the same thing. Ion Trail. Well, discarded in the end. This Ion Trail leading away from the project towards another star. Okay, sure. Sure, sure, sure. Sure, sure, sure. sure. Physics tech. Modified probe. Receiving a transmission from it. Uh, are you the makers? Yes, we made you. Then you shall die. A tough, tough crowd. Uh, let's... Oh, development speed. Oh, but automatic ex exploration. Where's the baddies now? Where's the bad things? Is it here? Oh, it's over there. Okay, we've established... Ah, key prime in the key system. Is all good. Okay, first things first. House. Good. That's fine. 46 strength. So we should be... Yeah, we'll wait for our reinforcements. And then we will go and smash the probe. Oh, you're still there, are you? Uh, go and research some crap. Research anomalies. 
research projects. Enjoy. It's a must take. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It's, it's I, to be honest, I don't understand why you don't have it from the start. It's one of those decisions where I'm like, I, I kind of understand that they don't want exploration to be an afterthought. But at the same time, it's a pain in the ass to keep um, to doing stuff. Big impact crater. That's what she said. It's a bit of a pain in the ass to just keep telling your science ships to keep doing stuff. Much easier just to go, just, just, just do it. I mean, the AI does. Uh, it was super far in the tech tree, and they changed it. Yeah, yeah, God, it was like really far to the point where, like, by the time you got it, there was basically nothing left to explore. A massive crater appears to be a result of a collision with a starship. Blah 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 blah. Remarkable. Ooh, mid-sized vessel was briefly taken. So the okay, sure. Uh, right, let's get courier network, and that gives us finisher. One additional district. Okay, nice. Nice. Right, what do I want to start off with? Uh, raiding? Crap. Instant Dominion? Eh, not bad. Extra technology is nice. One vision is okay. Mastery of nature is quite nice, but probably don't need it early on. More administrative capacity is quite nice. Edict duration is quite nice. Leader level cap is not so good at the moment. We don't have any subjects. Um, telling some guy in a ship just to fly around takes serious technology. <laughs> like, so what, it, it reminds me of... I used to play um, Star Trek Online. And there's this... It's quite a good like quest slash mission where you go to uh, the old... It was the... Sp it was the station in the Trouble with Tribbles, the old old series um, episode. It's the station, but in the future, and it's like it's no longer owned by the Federation. It's it's like it was junked, but there's like people's. It's like a bazaar on there or something, and you have to go like down into. It's like some weird shit going on, and you kind of go down into it, and um, it's a bit spooky. You get you get all the way down to the bottom. And you find there's like a time portal, at which point you're like, well, there's a time portal here. Best go back to Starfleet to report it. So you have to go all the way back out, fly back to Earth, go to the sp go to like Earth dock, and you go up to someone and go, there's a time portal. And he goes, oof. Well, you better go and investigate it. And you go, okay, thanks. And you go all the way back and through the time portal. And it's like, could, could we not have just, could, could we not have communicated that? It's is the future, after all. Hello, Fulgrim. Uh, so many triples. No commands yet. No, I'm I'm terrible. I go to tech or well, uh, uh, mastery of nature. Yeah, I'm I'm thinking technological ascendancy because that's just like a generally good one to get early on. So I think we're going to grab that. Like it's it just makes sense. More tech is good. Just keep surveying, I guess. Just keep survey. What's going on here? Oh, uh, several exemplary bowel fossils have been recovered, revealing the limbo. Um, the vault is a tomb for hopeless immortals. Science officer Emma Talgun asserts that huge blocks of ter ternary code found the databanks are neural images, digitized brain scans. Doubtlessly, the aliens of Eb and Nur 3 consider this to be their only shot at some kind of um, survival following whatever calamity befell their planet. They do not have the means to resurrect themselves, but banked on the impossible small hope that eventually someone else would have those means. Um, we do not, but download the neural patterns for safekeeping. Uh, good. Something about something, something, something. We get the idea. Good. Lovely. Okay. Adaptive bureaucracy. Fine. Uh, let's get the gene clinics because I probably should have got those before. Um, it's one that I rarely pick, honestly, but it's OP. Not that much. It's, I guess it's one of those that getting it early kind of gives you a... It gives better... Like The earlier you get it, the more benefit you get from it. Whereas some of them don't really matter. So, like... Um, 
the thingy of nature one, mastery of nature, right? You don't really need it to start off with because you, you don't, you don't your planets aren't filled up yet, so it's kind of pointless. Uh, sure, bring it up. Bring up the gas ship. Good. Right, so we got yeah, got more houses. Nice. Do I just want more houses? Probably. Probably. Okay, let's go and grab that one over there. Um, do you need mastery of nature for world shaping? I don't know. Good question. Good. Look at it. Uh, no, that one. World shaper. No, you just need climate restoration. Uh, alien barracks. Okay, good. Thanks, thanks for telling me you found some alien barracks. That's that's nice. Is my ship's ready yet? Yeah, yeah, good. Right, go over here. And we'll build that. And engineering. Why am I? I'm, I'm not getting notified that I've got research done. Am I? Or have I just not noticed it? Corvette hulls. Uh, yeah, that's probably the best one because it's just flat HP bonus. Can't go wrong with that. Uh, to extra distance, every planet is powerful. That is true. Probably take it after tech and one vision. One vision is pretty good. Oh, there's some good good minerals over here. But what's this? Finished their expedition. Blah blah blah. Uh, the EIL Rocky Balba. So the, the wrecked starship were too badly damaged. Okay, good. But we've got some research, which is good. What's this? Uh, coordinates describing the location of another former bowel colony have been extracted from the shattered Grenu data crystal. Perhaps the, the planet will boost, boost some of the riches sought after. Okay. Where is it? Over there. Go get it. Go get him. Go get him, champ. Recover probe. Let's... Oh. What's this? Sure. Do that. Uh, research project. Research project. What's this? Anything good? Nope. Complete crap. Never mind. Don't worry about that then. What's this one? Anything good? Oh, the Shattered. The crew of the EIL Rocky Downey Jr. were initially certain they have made a triangulation mistake when deducing the coordinates of the supposed bowel colony in the Marinia system, having found nothing but asteroids where they expected a life-bearing planet. However, a closer study of the asteroid's composition has revealed that they were in fact what remains of the former bowel colony. The once such planet was blown into several thousand rocky pieces by some unknown collision, occurring roughly seven million years ago. Deduction suggests the Grenier played some role in the planet's dark fate. One particular promising asteroid has been selected for further study, as it appears that it possess a large number of fossilized life forms from the lost planet. Good times. Illicit matters. Evidently, someone or something has managed to stabilize a one my wormhole. But some... Okay. Dark matter deposit found. Nice. Although, as far as I know, dark matter is completely useless for pretty much everything. I don't think I've ever found a use for it. Wow, there's like three crystals there. That's really good. Holy shit. That's nice. And more crystals there. God, we're going to have more crystals than we know what to do with. Dark matter. Um, One vision sounds like a Christian band. Or a band from the Brotherhood of Nod. They'd have given free drinks under the concert spiked the green crystal... Tiberium, yeah. Personally, I'll sign it with the biological ascension being second. Some mods make use of it, but that's it. Dark matter is for late game. It, I mean, it doesn't... It doesn't seem to be that useful to me. I've never, like, I had loads of it and didn't really have anything to use for it. Um, sure. Uh, since it got overbalanced way too hard, the pop growth is nuts. Life electric. Uh, surface resulting in illumination. Blah, 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 blah. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Oh, uh, what was that? What's that? Something big collided? Yeah, probably a mum. Ooh. 
Uh, oh god, we've met... Where? In Zuli Crow. That does not... S Hello. Insects. Right. I need to grab, ideally, the, I mean, I'd like... What's that got? I mean, that would be quite nice, but I don't think we're going to be able to grab that. Ooh, that's nice as well. Okay, oh, it's 525. Okay, we can we can probably grab um, Julo. Doop, 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 doop. Yep, yeah, that'll be fine. That'll be fine. We'll grab that. Keep them off. Fresh victims. Yes, the first. The first who aren't massively more powerful than us. Ah, look at this. Automatic exploration. Good. Uh, let's get more energy credits, because God knows I'm suffering for energy credits. And where's our fleet? There's our fleet. Get them, boys. Asteroid collision. Okay, turns out it wasn't your mother. Get them, lads. Yeah. The first battle is with our own probe. Good job, guys. Nice work. Back to base. Okay, let's grab that one. Magma. Magum. It's Magum. Where's Magum? Uh, what type of fanatic purifiers or something or slavers? Nope, just just we 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 are um, fanatic militarist and authoritarian. And he, he, the Emperor Magmar is a champion of the people and warlike. So that's fun. He's got depth. What we got here: dust caverns, crystalline. Ca okay, good. We've collected that probe. Oh, Luca McLuca face. You're not doing anything. Go and explore. And Rocky Balboa. You can also go and automatically explore because now I don't have to worry about telling you where to go. Although I do find that the automatic exploration tends to send them in the same direction. Like they'll end up like you, you all of the all the science ship will suddenly go. Oh, I want to go and just discover this one system over here and just head on that direction. It can be sometimes a little bit annoying. Okay, let's grab those research stations. Um, Sure. What's this? We have managed to extract some data fragments from a particularly well-preserved bowel biocomputer fossil. This 10 million year old relic appears to contain pedological information intended for immature members of the species, not yet to receive the full range of the hive mind's neural connection. Young bowel or saplings were introduced to growth techniques, horticulture and nutrition in a more curated experience. These findings suggest bowel society prized ter terrestrial landscaping and ecosystem management and also highly depend on it for their survival. Fine. Good. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Galactic Pithok Alliance. Hello. Who are you? You are fanatic egalitarian and xenophile. You're probably going to hate my guts. Respect our authority. Do you hate our guts? Minus 50. I mean... Could be worse. Could be worse. Yeah, they, they don't like me. They don't like me. Not fans. Or they explore somewhere on the other side of the galaxy so exploring that one system. Yeah, exactly. Uh, oh no. Luca Luca face forced to return to Keed. The borders of the Galactic Pithok Alliance. Bloody Pithok. Taking the pith, you off me. And no one did. Weapon testing. It seems the apocalypse has come uh, to Magam 4As many times over. Surface scans reveal the planet has been scorched, bombarded, and seared, and peppered in what is some sort of extensive weapon testing have yet to encounter. Uh, the countless attempts have been made to obliterate the planet entirely. It appears the ends have yet to develop technology. Um, Analyze the samples. Yeah, I mean, of course we can analyze the samples. Why would I not? Uh, small rectangular objects. Sure. 
I love small rectangular objects. They're some of my favourite objects. Gene Clinics, good. And uh, I guess that. I'm not that invested, but sure. Uh, three people. Fine. Alien mural. Okay. Right, let's go and go there. You can... What are you doing? Go research that. Okay, so at least we're safe over here. Let's get more of them. And we'll build a space station. Alien lasers! UV lasers uh, or armour. Um, let's get lasers. Can't go wrong with shooting people. Kids. Uh, let's investigate the gigantic swoopy skeleton over there. Yeah, I didn't think the Pithook would like us very much. And they don't. Um, oh, it is getting better though. I mean, it's only going to be minus 30. That might be enough for them to not really care. Um, unusual. Okay, sure. Right, let's go and quickly grab that. I might try and grab Vinjim. Or maybe this one's better. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, Luca, go and explore. Um... Empire playing. I missed the beginning of the stream. I'm playing the evil rock lords. Yeah, fanatic military. Yeah, there, there you go. Name this man said it. Uh, go wrong with the shooting people you found me. <laughs> exactly. Uh, Sonified science. Curious. Yes. Don't know what it is. Do not care. Salvages. Hello. Uh, what you want, alien? This probe ours. Salvage. We find first. You leave now. Yes. Interrupting delicate operation. You ships are. Must concentrate. Or, if you want probe, we sell it to 100 credits. Um, where are you? Just give me my ship. Ho ho, listen to ugly alien boys. Bawaggy, drop what you're doing and come over here to the console. Listen to this fool. This probe... Oh, go to hell. Get a hell. It's my first wave. I don't think you're going to do very... Hang on. Hello. Greetings, evil rock lords. We understand your empire has come into possession of a cache of data containing the brain scans of an extinct species taken from the very world they once inhabited. Even though your species is too primitive to utilize this data, we laud your efforts in preserving the last remnants of a once vibrant civilization. As part of our efforts to conserve and catalogue endangered species and our endangered species preserve, we wish to take this data and use our cloning technologies to bring a small number of the species back to life. Will you share it with us so we can fulfill their last wishes together? Um... Sure. Knock yourself out. Okay, we'll, we'll send my fleet over. They'll deal with that problem. Sorted. Uh, oh, you can't get past now, can you? That's fine. Phoenix Order is probably enslaved by now. Wow. So he's an actual opponent for Arcano Empire. I have. I've put them in there. Um, it appears to be a natural occurring subspace phenomena in the Bunda system. Yes, like it lit. Sure. Okay, how is our cohesion? Cohesion's fine. I could go. Mm, I don't. I think maybe I'm just going to hold here and then fill up behind. I don't think it's worth taking that. So we're just going to leave it. But what I am going to do is I'm going to upgrade this star base. More energy credits. That's really useful. Uh, UV lasers could do. Oh, let's get that because then I, what I want to do is I want to colonize this. So let's colonize that and then they'll have to take the planet before they could, if they attack us, they'll have to take the planet before they can get through. And they won't be able to do that. 
Um, we'll see, Commonus. Arcadians are a hardy bunch. Discovery of an ancient Baal biocomputer remnants is yet to get further insights of planetoid hive mind's history. The Baal appear to have originated from a single planet, location unknown as mere plant life. Prehistoric Baal were all clones of their parent plant and gradually developed the capacity for hive consciousness over millions of years of slow, peaceful growth on their home planet. Remarkable. Probe recovered. Nice. We covered our sublight probe, the wreckage of the alien salvage ship. It's a bit dented, and parts of it are covered in some kind of alien graffiti uh, put there by the salvagers to mark valuable components. Despite this, we have managed to download detailed sensor readings of the entire Yandu system from the probe's memory. Okay, good. Good, good. And then you can just do stuff, I guess? Wait, if you go there, is there a thing? The archaeological expedition on XR709L have reported delays caused by unlikely serious equipment foundations. Uh, my functions work has been momentarily delayed until replacements can be acquired. Sure. Okay, you know what I want? So I want this one because big minerals. Really? They look like puny elves. Just you wait. I mean, they're... they're uh, okay, yeah, it's down there, isn't it? Okay, go and grab that. Um, I mean, they'll probably be friends with the Galactic Pithok Alliance, so... Because they're pretty similar. Uh, I just don't trust it. Just go go that system. Why Guvis Eater Aliens? Where are they? Over there. Oh no, there's like lots of planets there, and I wanted all them. That's a delicious miney planet. Mm -mm -mm, tasty. Uh, right. Shall I go Discovery? I, mm. I kind of want to... Mm. What, okay, what do we think? What do we think? Shall I go... Shall I go Discovery? Or... I, I quite like um, Prosperity. Supremacy to bully your enemies and enslave them. Wow, that's uh, it's going strong. Okay, so discovery or supremacy? Kind of tempted by discovery. Discovery is probably yeah. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, let's let's go let's go for discovery. Let's do that. Let's do that. Uh, edicts. Can we do anything? Trust, growth, governing ethics. Well, I mean, we're not too worried about that. Capacity overload. Mm, well, at the moment... Corvette hull points. That's useful. Let's go for engineering research. At the moment... I want to do that. Probe recovered. Lovely. Probes collected. Excellent. So that's more energy and some research, which is nice to see. Right, you can go and do some searches over there. Um, we've got the colony ship. They'll go and colonize this planet over here, and that will then create us a nice little um, fortress world. So that if the Pithok Alliance do decide to attack us, they're going to be dicked over. Energy is not great, but it's it's fine. You've got enough sofas. I'm kind of tempted to go mineral, mineral purification plants. Oh, we need more amenities, don't we? Let's go gene clinics. Obviously, obvious answer really. Gene clinics. Gene clinic it up. Abandoned gateway. Intriguing. Right over there. We could potentially grab these systems. There's no reason we can't. I mean, yeah, we'd kind of envelop the, the these guys, but not, not you. But, I mean, they quite like us at the moment. They haven't given us anything, but they quite like us. So that's nice. The Zum Centralized Stars. Hello. 
you are oh you're militarists and uh, materialists which is fine uh respect our authority okay you're over there you might be more amenable you don't like someone you're not fans with someone you've only just met us so that's fine Right, let's beef this up. Gun battery. And... Ooh. Just, I kind of want to go disruption field generator. There's shields. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Good. Excellent. Do the enigmatic observer fallen empire care about your border? For no, they, they don't care. Um, they're pretty pretty chill about that to be honest. Uh, meanwhile, the, the the isolationists, if if you put a system next to it, they will basically kick the shit out of you. Uh, Stumbled upon a faint alien signal. Okay, good. Let's research that. Let's send you back to um, to our home world. That's that feels pretty good. Oh, we got tech. Good. Fleet command limits. Let's go for more research. And we're building gene clinics there to increase our population growth because we kind of need to. Ancient battle sites. Over there. Okay, we won't get that one. Our five pilots. Nice. Bit spoopy, but nice. Indeed, we defend the people we need to, but peace and life are preferable over the chaos of war. Probably a good idea. Hopefully they don't awaken before you can beat them. Otherwise, I think they do try to think. Yeah, they, they do. Hello, what we got? The Shattered. The Grenade Data Crystal has been recovered on XR709L, dating to some 7 million years ago. The Data Crystal contains partially readable military records pertaining to the planet's invasion. Apparently, the Grenier were expecting some measure of armed resistance and were not impressed by the incredibly slow-moving bowel. The record describes the ease to which the bowel delayed response was circumvented in a highly derogatory fashion. Well, there we go. There we go. Okay, I think this, this is pretty good. I'm pretty happy with this. Nice little corner here. We can fortify ourselves. Uh... Zro. Hello. Your species is the most worthwhile addition to the galactic community. As a token of esteem, we have decided to bestow on you a generous gift of valuable minerals and resources. How much can we have? 15k. Okay, we graciously accept. Thanks, guys. Nerds. Oh, jeez, four pop, really? Okay, one more and we can get a gene clinic there, which will be useful. When they awaken, it will probably be a war in heaven with MA going to hell. <laughs> yes, yes, probably. Uh, let's get the gene clinic. And we'll go and build a starbase down there. Good. Details. Yeah, so... Yeah, these do less shield damage. So by reducing shield hit point, it gives our star base more chance to kill stuff. That's, that's a scary... Yeah, that's what I thought. I was like, I'm literally right in the middle here. They will both try and kill me. They'll both go, you're going to be on my side. And at that point, I'm like... I don't know. I can, can, I, can I be... Can I... Can I be space Switzerland, please? And I'll probably be like, no. No, you get, you get to choose. Choose your death. So that'll be fun. I just have to be, I have to be stronger than them and kill them sooner. Hello, you want to give me stuff? All right. Thanks. Um, entire region is going to be on fire. Eh, pretty much par for the course with me. 
Do you know what people often are confused when the sentences are different from what they cheesecake? I do love cheesecake. Tell you what, my wife once made this. Um, it was for Ferrero Rocher cheesecake, like Nutella flavor cheesecake. Oh, that thing tasted so good. There were about a trillion calories in every single slice, though. Oh, it's so good. So good. Uh, what's this going? Another Grenada data crystal has been unearthed. Do you take a series of military orders, including your coordinates? So, yes, another bowel colony. Our archaeologists eager to further unravel the history of these two foes are uploading the data now. Third time's the charm? Maybe. Maybe. Really? Okay. Go back there. Uh, what are you doing? Just. That's it. Keep, keep going. Okay, we've got the gene clinic. That's nice. Because that's giving us some more pop. It is using some of our sofas. I guess they, they put it around the reception area to make it look nice, which is fair enough. Uh, has been fully excavated, has it? Okay, good. That's good. Four bowel colony, the silenced. Our researchers were excited to discover the location of a third bowel colony corresponds to a planet still possessing an atmosphere and life. While Boon, really? Holy shit. Um, is that always there? Did I just imagine that? I can't fucking know. Um, while Bunda 3 does not seem particularly lush or remarkably resource laden, our scientists are eager to begin a targeted excavation to search for any remnants of the battle or the Grenur. Yeah, can you just look? Just, just excavate the site. Dig it up. Do a time team. Sir Penham, hello. Finally managed to watch live. Hi there, welcome. Uh, well, there's so little people watching Star Wars on Twitch. A paradox game is way more niche than I thought. I don't know, seems alright. I, I guess strategy games are a bit niche. Magmar now has an eye for talents. Holy shit, what a guy. Look at this. Good. So we've got... Right, Frontier Sector, that's fine. How's our population growth going? How... how 1.1? Holy... <sighs> Insights... Where? Interesting. Planty people. Ah, they, they must be who they're at war with. Or not at war with, but they've rivaled with. That's that's interesting. Hello! That looks like a tasty world that I want. Uh, you know what I need? I need another construction ship. I need another construction ship. So let's build another construction ship. Let's advance... Okay, good engineering. Do I want star hold? Gas extraction? Well, I don't really need the gas at the moment. Corvette build speed. Mare star hold. You are building... Right. I need to claim some of this. Obviously, not that one or that one. A curator order. Hello. Ugh, tentacles. We are the, we are the curators. Our ancient order was established eons ago by various galactic powers and ascendancy at the time. Blah, 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 blah. Something about failing. Who cares? Ah, oh, we're not going to get that. And the Miravandi order. Evangelizing zealots. Good. Um, how do you feel about them? Opinions. Oh, you quite like them, which means you've probably got open borders. Stupid, friendly jerks. No, I want that one. No, that one. No, that one. Which one? That one. That one. There we go. Yeah, you, you don't like me. That's fair. That's fair. Okay. Construction ship. Construction ship go there. What's this one? Strange flows. I don't think I've ever done that before. So that could be interesting. We should probably go and dig that up while we're around here. Okay, you don't like me, but the Zum do. And you don't like the Miravandi, so maybe there is some common purpose there, which we can use. 
Tippenham, thank you for the follow. Uh, yes, good. That's going to keep people out of my space. Research station. Oh, what's this? Optical sensors in isolate a cluster of shapes. Go and have a look. I mean, I don't know why this is going to take you almost a fucking year to identify some shapes on a... Pl oh, sure, whatever. Uh, research increase speed. Yes, do that. Do that. Um... Oh, I, you know what I always forget about is trade. I always forget about trade. And one of the things I keep thinking is that... Wait, what was this? What was the, um, what was the revelation I had about this? You never want to build space stations on systems which don't have which which have trade resource because when you do that it creates another trade lane which you then have to defend so the best thing to do is build them on anything but so don't build a space station on this one because otherwise you you end up with another trade lane which then spawns pirates name this man thank you for follow haven't played Stellaris in almost a year now ah oh, but it's it's so good I love Stellaris. Like, I know it's got its issues. It does. And yet, I still love it. Did you not go to investigate the giant skeleton? Developed a new skill. Biology. Oh, he's following Luca. In her creepy interest for horrible meat things. Excavate. Where is Luca now? I should over there. Unusual tectonics. Good. I guess. Is that good? Is Luca still the glory initiative? What's she unhappy about? She wants conquests, local rivalry, and imperial heg... Luke is a very, very angry individual. Just wants to murder everyone. I mean, that's fair. I guess. Moon PC is dead. Oh, no! Oh, I really hate it when, like... I've had this in the past. Fortunately, not recently, touch wood. <laughs> When you like, you, you switch your computer on, and it was fine the previous day. You switch it on, it just goes nothing. It's just clunk. And you're like, oh no, what? Uh, continuous studies of massive skeletal remains, uh, dimensional portal or something. Astounding. Yep. Diminished capabilities. Excavation on Baundi 3 have revealed a number of fossils clearly related to the Baul. But curiously, these specimens appear to have diminished neurological organs required for subspace emphasis communication. That is to say, the ability to communicate neurologically over great... Why don't you just say that, nerd? A faculty requires... Uh, a faculty unique to hive minds. What definitive causes may have participated in this evolutionary swing are unknown, though it would be remiss to assume the Grinoa invasion was unrelated. Further investigations are warranted. Sure. Uh, let's translate the alien mural because reasons. Time to go conquer IKEA. Ah, oh, have fun at IKEA, Luca. I hate IKEA, apart from the meatballs, which are really good. And rival the whatever guys you met, uh, these guys, but they gave me some stuff. Like we're deeply concerned about the lack of freedom among your citizens, evil rock lords. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, amazing. Uh, amazing. Uh, what? Oh, it's this one. Oh, no, it was this. It was Kai that had the um, the good mining, didn't it? Yeah, because it's got the the high quality minerals. It's not got very many mining districts, but we will fill it up with mining districts because reasons, I guess. Good, 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 good. And what we got over here, uh, right, housing is fine. We don't have any available jobs, so there's no point building anything because it would just be a waste of resources. Okay, then rival the zealots. I could do that. I could do that, and that would make these guys happy because I know then, oh, they're not rivaled with them. Interesting. So they're, they're, they're rivaled someone else. Hmm, okay. Okay. Interesting. Okay, we've got a trade route from there to there, although it's currently making... Nothing. So, that's fine. 
Oh god, these guys. Uh, research, good. Let's go oh, improve deflectors. Let's go improve deflectors because I want some defense for my for my little shippies. And let's go over here. I would like to see if we could grab these ones down here. It's going to be quite expensive um, in influence, but we actually got quite a lot of influence, so I don't think it's going to be a major issue. But we could grab these, and that would be quite nice. Plus, if they're not particularly bothered by us, it's not a big deal. The only problem is defending it, because we don't have a choke point against these guys. Um, but I guess we'll just have to play it by ear. Probably fine. Be alright. Uh, try and trade communications with them. That's a good point. Uh, teach them to explorers. The EIL Luca McLuca face crew is reporting they found something spectacular on Penaosta 2A on the surface lies trace of an explorative expedition from okay. Um let's 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 do some stuff. And we're going to grab survey increase, research alternatives. Oh that's quite nice. Uh let's go boldly go. Made the choice. Right, could we grab this? Oh, it's not that expensive. Do I, do, I, right, do I go grab these ones? Because the only problem is I can't defend it against anyone. They'll be by themselves. Oh, this one's not. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm grabbing that. It's worth the influence. I mean, that's trash, but never mind. Um, good. Uh, Special Officer Hema tells blah 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 something about some research. Good. I'll take that. That was down there. Oh. Okay, this... Just just do some running around, it's fine. Younger bowel fossil specimens have been uncovered from the geological record. Though these no longer have diminished hive neurology, instead the structures required for soft space emphasis communication are entirely missing. Carbon dating of these specimens have confirmed that some hundreds of years following the Grenoa invasion, the bowel began to develop uh, began to develop the ability to connect to one another as a hive mind. Unfortunately, it seems that no further resident blah 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 something like that. Good. Knock yourself out, guys. Keep keep going. Grenoa distress signal. Scientists have picked up distress signals. Bearing Grenier datalogical signatures it appears to originate from a system previously unknown to us near Cortex. What kind of ancient message could possibly contain? Our scientists like to investigate the signal's point of origin. Oh, look, it's right there. Go to it. Uh, no planet after me, then destroy it. If only I had that technology. Salty popcorn, I would. So pick up movement on the hellish surface of Ken. Sure, go and have a look at Ken. Oh, there's a row here as well, so that'd be quite nice to have. I'd like to grab these two. Maybe see if we can grab them as well. That would be quite nice. Geothermal, good. I mean, we're not grabbing that because obviously the, the military isolationists would completely murder us. Zero is only useful for psionics or selling. Either way, uh, I wanted to talk to you guys, didn't I? Uh, of a trade deal. Information. Communications. Really? They're like, yeah, we'll give you communications. I'm like, do you want mine? Nah. Oh, wait, that did that. That was me asking for, that was me giving them that. Right, I did the wrong thing. Did I do the wrong thing? I don't know. Uh, of a trade deal. I want your communications. Do you want my communications? No. Okay. What about some minerals? Bowel organism. The EIL Rocky Downey Jr. crew have traced the Grenoa distress signal to a source, uncovering a crumbling Grenoa research facility hanging in the orbit of an otherwise long abandoned planet. The facility is reaching critical energy failure, having survived for millions of years on an extensive network of solar panels and decaying water repair systems, all of which are now approaching terminal status. Shockingly enough, scans of the facility are revealing the presence of a single life form. Crew have dispatched an away team and are ready to report. Deep in the dilapidated ruins of the time-worn Grenoa research facility, among the long defunct computer panels and deteriorated research equipment, our ship's crew have made an incredible find. Pin cushioned by nutrient tubes and critically failing life support systems lies one signal organism, the last bowel. The 
miraculously still alive, surrounded by the sludgy remains of other species, uh, specimens in a row of cracked and leaking vats. Owing to our extensive previous archaeological studies on the specimen, we should be able to attempt communication with the last specimen. Sure. Um, don't useful for shields and jump drives. Not, not saying that good. I wish you can gift silent for good relationships. Oh, that worked. Uh, visitor, can it be? The bowel shudders in its fat. But you are not the ones who brought put us here. Although you come as alarm sound, have you come to give us peace at last? Perhaps first we have some questions. The bowel is silent for several minutes, then ask. We have waited millennia. We can endure a moment more. Um, tell us about yourself. Long minutes pass before the bowel responds. Ourselves? Ourself. Yes. What is there to tell? We sat beneath the stars on soft earth, unfurled our leaves like sails to the sun overhead. We remember every drop of water that quenched them in the parched summers, every shivering whore that blanketed them in winters. We bent in the winds, the stars wheeled overhead. We were uprooted, we were burned, we were sliced, we were left here. We watched our, other, our others rot in the glass prisons. And are you single? What happened to the bowel? Again, the bowel is long silent before managing to reply. When the burners came, entire colonies were silenced before the danger was known to us, like a limb gone limp, nerves cut suddenly and totally at the base, and then we lost the next, and the next, and the next, one by one, their voices lost, uh, left the chorus. We lost our others, their silence deafened us who remained. Can you understand, Visitor? We were not bare to hear more agony. The burners were swift like you, swifter, and before we could withdraw, they had us set us aflame, all burnt to ash, and the air filled with grey agony, the dust of our lost. Would you like to join us? A sort of shiver runs through a bowel. You have a distinct impression it's laughing. No, we have lived l too long in this wretched state. Now we long only for an end. Though first, would you let us? Would you tell us? Um, we have been sealed here for so long, blind to all that in this room, watching the stale air slowly wear the station down to its metal bones. Tell us, does our kind yet live? Um, now we don't have time for this. Pull the plug. <laughs> More vegetables and trees. Keep it light, little tree. Uh, reaching for the tubes the f uh, that ferry mysterious nutrients in and out of the creature's form, your scientists begin to jerk them loose, expediating the machine's failure, and thereby the last bowel, the last bowel's death. The bowl seems to make no press protest as you work, unless the slight tremor running through its withered limbs is meant to signify something. Finally, the work is complete, and one final tremor runs through the creature before it expires. Well, that's that. Uh, month uh, not monthly minerals. No, oh minerals. Yeah. that good right uh, society research we could uplift Pfft, nah. star base capacity uh, planetary capital sure so we've now got a relic the last bowel so it costs 150 influence to use increases our pop growth and also um ability to turn one non equinopopopolis non-hive world non-machine world planet into a gaia world Seems pretty good, doesn't it? Passive. Oh, it passively increases. Oh, nice. That's useful. Um, we could use it here. We could use it here. So. Oh, yeah, passive for correct. Look at that. And you should use the secrets of the bowel. Uh, oh, this one. Del what does that do? What does it do? Virus. Little Alex Horn, what does it do? I believe the transformation is instant as well. Is this? It is, yes. It is. Uh, secrets of the yeah, it? What does it do? What, what, what does it do? What does it do? Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. What does it do? No idea. But others. No. Oh. Don't know. All right. Okay. We'll do it. It was a special project. Ooh. Hello. 27 months. What are we... That's uh, fine. Do it. Do it, do it, do it. Do it, do it, do it. Do it, do it, do it. I'm, I'm thinking maybe we do it here. Because... Good minerals. It's 70% habitability. So it would be quite useful to actually have it here. So I'm thinking we do that. So we activate it, we go here, and we go new bowel life seeding. Boff. Um, 
First thing is level four city district tech. Ooh. That sounds good. Oh, if it removes the special thingies. I don't have any special. Oh, what this? Fuck. I hope he doesn't. Well, I guess we'll find out. Um, incredible. Excellent. More slaves. Oh, fuck it. I guess we're supposed to have to deal with them? Okay, good. It's it's still fine. Um, I mean, we currently have no food. And these pops, I guess, need food. Yeah. Okay. I guess we'll build some food for them then. Otherwise, they'll just starve to death. Insta guy while terraforming. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Nice. What can what 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 what, what do they do? Can we see? Um, agrarian, communal, venerable, delicious, slow, delicious. Okay. Slow breeders guy while preference. Right. Okay. Okay, well, that's fine. It's, it's all right. They can make food for us. We can use energy. We can make, make, use food to make energy. So I guess that's fine. Um, you can survey this system. Since it's down here, it looks like there's a tomb world. Yeah. <gasps> Holy mother of God! Fuck! I should have I should have colonized this and then and then. Right, as, as soon as we get the thing... What's going on? Oh, food. Oh, yeah, well, that's fine. Right. As soon as we get the, the next life seeding, we're colonising this crap hole and then guy lifing it. So many minerals. All the minerals. Are there always like trolls from Discworld? Kind of. They're rocks that eat rocks. So, Cole, have you... Um, yeah, I, I, guess, I guess, I mean, the trolls are basically rocks, aren't they? So I guess I guess that's true. Yes, I guess that would be correct. Okay, let's grab this one. Um, it's a little bit awkward here because it's, it's tricky to defend this, but we're just we're just gonna we're just gonna run with it. Because uh, the. Because the trolls in Discworld, it's because their brains are made of silicon, isn't it? And so they work better when they're cold. But I guess it depends what your rock species are like. Faint traces of weapon radiation? Sure. Well, this is lovely. Um, we'll, get, we'll get some food and uh, that should hopefully stop them from starving. Be alright. There we go. They're not starving anymore. Yeah, look at that. See, they're fine. Good. Lovely. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. 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 All right. Uh, I could... I mean, the thing is... They're like... They make food, right? I mean, I, I could, like, build another farm and then use it to produce energy. I'm kind of tempted to do that. Because, I mean, we've still got... Sure, let's do that. We need the energy anyway. Alien spacecraft. Uh, examine the logs. Always examine the logs in alien spacecraft. Asteroid sighted. Jeweler Prime. Oh, that's fucking miles away. Oh. Is that in... Re oh. Okay, where's my fleet? Get over there. Moon bump. Even with the naked eye, it's easy to see something regular in the shape of Grino 1. The smooth curvature of the surface is suddenly interrupted by a giant spherical bump. At some point, a moon or large asteroid collided with the planet. Must have been a blah, blah, blah. Fine. We'll have a look at that at some point. Deal with that. I think the space station will be in range to defend it, but I'm just not 100% sure. Oh, I meant to do that. Let's do... Get a couple of couple of them got agriculture district that should then produce enough food i'm hoping 31 yeah so then oh we can upgrade this 
And then we can get the bioreactor. And that'll give us some energy, which we need. And they'll still have enough food to survive. A massive storms visible in the upper atmosphere of this gas giant's shore. Okay, let's go and do... Are they getting uppity about the... Nope, they don't care. They're like, yep, cozy up to me. No problem. Spoon me. Spoon me, evil rock lords. Spoon me. Uh, take it a step further. Let them pamper your pops or send them to nom nom your em enemies. I mean, that is an option. That is an option. I mean, currently, they're just we're just using them to make food, and then we can use food to create energy. That works. What's this? Extreme storms? Sure. Let's do something like that. Do something like that. Let's do something like that. I've got research. Ah, I quite like energy credits, but UV lasers. I don't think we're in any trouble at the moment, so let's go just for more energy credits because I kind of need it. So that'll be fine. Zum central. Oh no, Zum. What, what's going on, buddies? What's going on? Minus. What? What? No, no, Zum. But we were friends. Zum. Oh, fucking stupid horse monsters. Why? Why, horse monsters? Why? We could have been friends. We could have been friends. What a pile of dicks. Um. Does it even count? It counts as a f yes, it counts as a fleet. It's fine. It's a little fleet. It's an equal one. It's it's so good being so, so rude to my fleet. Honest, I I oh, uh, Beta Aquila. Hello. Oh, it's horrible. More meat monsters. God, this galaxy is absolutely riddled with meat monsters. It's horrible. They're all squishy. Oh God. Right, Starhold, good. Let's get destroyers. Destroyers are the way forward. Okay. Laser in that rock. Asteroid destroyed. Whoop whoop. We're all good. Uh, equipment malfunction at Strange Flows and apparently found a something. What are you doing? Are you doing anything? You're not doing anything. Go and research the, the thing. Abandoned gateway. Oh god, why can they not make it so you can actually it tags the actual system so when you look. Oh, okay, that does it. Good. It irks me whenever I go, where is this thing happening? It just takes me right to the centre of the galaxy because it hasn't twigged where it is yet. Uh, sure, research that. Let's go and grab all these bits. And we'll grab the Rubicator. Analysis of the ship's logs reveal that crew met its demise when trying to achieve an irreplicable an artifact called the Rubicator. It was stolen from the society by a pack of thieving rats. A curious choice of words as they themselves are most rat-like in appearance. The logs are mainly comprised of curses, willing the rat robbers to the end of the universe um, and beyond. The crew has counted upwards of 50 individual worlds with de uh, defecation, as well as a wide selection of places from which a star's light cannot escape, but the Aridus work has paid off. We must have the Rubicator. Scans of uh, uncovered an to do with the surface. Purpose of deja vu dig. Okay, sure. Uh, oh, that's that's on my empire. Yeah. Okay. Oh, hello. Hello. I guess we'll go and find you. Let's go. L cluster. I wonder what we'll get this time. And the Rubicator as well. I know. Once triggered, the the no fleets and the whole galaxy got wrecked. That was I, right. I, I put a, a series on YouTube, and I was, I was, I was ready. Right, I, I would, I'd never opened the L cluster before. I was ready. I was, I was like, we, we, we're doing this. I had, I had like all of my fleets. I had four massive fleets waking. I had a, I built like a big space station around the L cluster gate that I had. 
I was waiting, like all my ships poised, waiting. Opened the L gates, nothing. Went through. It was the the event where you find like the the one guy on the planet. I was like, I was I was hoping for like an invasion, but no, I got the really rare event that's boring. I was like, well, that's rubbish. Secrets of Baal. We're carefully tracking the changes that Baal underwent during their loss in sentience. We have gained much knowledge on how to reverse the process. We've also gained new insights into the speed, spread of plant life and improved our terraforming process. So, we get reduction in terraforming costs, which considering that that doesn't really matter for us because we have high thingy anyway. And epidogenic triggers. What the fuck is that? The fuck is that? That's a research for gene modding. Oh, okay. Oh. Unspent trait points. Visuri Irasu. Hey. Oh, right. You can uplift them. Right, 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 right. I'm, I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm with you. Um. Wait, no. Doesn't it usually say uplifting? I don't understand. Click to open speech. Right, shift. The Visari. I haven't met the Visari. What? Who the fuck are the Rons are? It's odd. I don't really know what's going on there. Oh, it happened to Thyrus as well. Okay, good. At least I'm not the only one. What? That doesn't make any sense, does it? Uh, can we... Okay, let's grab... Sure. How... Right, if I go... That's going to cost one... Okay, yeah. Grab that one, then hopefully we can grab that one. Although we're, no... we're now rivals with them, aren't we? Okay, let's upgrade the cube! Among the husks of derelict spaceships orbiting Imadar 1, we have discovered an almost intact alien research vessel. The ship's logs reveal it suffered critical hardware malfunction. It was stuck in limbo for 142 days before the crew perished from malnutrition. The body of the captain was found and he is caught clutching a small metal cube, each side a different colour and split into nine equal rotatable squares. Uh, Science officer Luca is convinced that when rotating the correct pattern, the cube will open to reveal a hidden treasure, which I assume she hopes is some kind of weapon. Rotate those squares! Rotate the boards. That's number wang. Sure, research. Uh, right. What's this? Cube. Moon bump. Anyone home? Don't care. What the fuck is that? Where's this? Oh. I kind of want that. I don't think I can reach it though. Uh, right. The cube. Luca, I want to know what's in that cube. Get Cuban. Right, keyed. You have... Um, let's go for mines. I'm a little bit concerned we might get, like, massively overwhelmed with bowel, though. Although currently our rocks are, are the ones unemployed, so that's fine. Uh, we've got one of you guys who aren't doing anything... Uh, we've got amenities. Oh, I could... You know what? Let's get... Oh, we don't... We need more sofas. More sofas. Build more sofas. Try switching to Empire Species. Oh, the Rubicator. 
the coordinates of the Rubicate's last known location, we have discovered a habitable planet with what we believe may be some form of settlement covering a large portion of its surface. The settlement consists of tall, pile-like towers visible all the way from space. Our archaeologists are eager to excavate it and search the Rubicate. Start digging, boys! Oh, hello! Relic world. Nice. Definitely want that bad boy. Uh, survey. Survey. The rat planets. Are you able to purge your empire? Because that might be evil, but an effective idea. I'm, I might have to if the bowel will just keep, like, spreading. I'm a little bit concerned because... Slice and dice. The crew of ERL Luca McLucaface has subjected the metal cube to every code-breaking algorithm known to us and has responded with nothing but silence. Is it a cipher? A container for valuable items. If there is no meaning behind the cube, what is then the meaning of anything? Were some of the thoughts that scurried through the overworked mind of Science Officer Luca. When they finally brought out the laser and sliced for, uh, first the cube, then their right appendage in half, the cube was empty. Oh dear. Oh dear. Poor Luca. She's gone mad. Not for the first time. Uh, let's research the anomalies. You didn't have that? I don't think I've seen that before. I think I've seen it on a stream, but I don't think I've got it. Uh, Extremophilia. Luke and the crew made a surprise discovery in an Imadar 1A. A molten planet is home to it. I know it spawns something if you do the excavation, but that that's all I know. The battery in deep live, blah, 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 something about. Oh, I don't. What's this? Gas. Okay, sure. Give me gas. Okay, Luke is going to continue her exploration. Having cut her right appendage off, poor old Luca, just made her made her angrier. Ah, uh, do I want this? Oh, they got it. Oh, they got there before me. All right, never mind. Not the end of the world. Let's go grab that. Little bit concerned, but I'm sure we'll be fine. Right, ship designer. Why are we a picket ship? What the fuck? Just make me... Why do I look like a poo? Oh, never mind. Right, blue lasers. Oh, it's done that thing where it's decided to... Spoilers, you ruined the surprise. Well... Uh, right. Okay, don't... Just... Yeah, don't upgrade, because, frankly, that seems stupid. So, let's save that. Because that's better. Then upgrade, because there's no point making them into picket ships. That's a massive waste of time. A ruined world! Good. Everyone loves a ruined world. The Matriarch. A creature of legend swims languis... Lang... Uh, between the gas giants dotting the Millie system. With tentacles longer than, av than an evil rock lord's battleship, her gargantuan proportions defy all our previous encounters with organic life. The creature's magnificent glowing hide stands out startling against the void of space. And we don't know where she is. Uh... Away from enemy fleet. Oh no! <laughs> Luca got tentacled to death! Oh no! Oh no! Luca got tentacled! Oh shit. Luca was iced. Okay, well... Incredible. <sighs> Obviously, hadn't seen enough hentai. Otherwise, she would have known better. Shameful. Shameful. Um, right. Goods. Goods. Died by tentacles. 
<sighs> oh dear. Poor Luca. After cutting off, she, she's had a, she's had a bad year. Cutting off her appendage and then strangled to death by tentacles, or at least I hope she was strangled to death. Otherwise, you know, bad things. Uh, good. Let's make more ships, and I need more alloys. Really, that would be good. Uh, what was her full name? Uh, her, it was just Luca. The, the science ship was Luca McLuca Face. Poor old Luca McLuca face. So sad. Why must the young die so quickly to tentacles? I need more alloys. Orbital speed demons! Uh, attempts to scan the object in high speed orbit of blah blah blah. Uh, try and slow it down. Uh, open it. Now we should get the option. Red, green, blue. Oh, is it, is it a thing? 31 months to crack open a fucking box? What the fuck are you doing with it? Son of a... Alright, do it. I've tried looking at it, and I've tried shouting at it. I've tried everything, and it's not open. Surrounded by idiots. Okay, how's the population grow? I'm, I'm a little bit... I just don't want the bowels to like overwhelm us with sheer weight numbers. Um, what are... Hang on. Species. Empire species. Right, new bowel. They're residents. They're delicious, apparently. Um, they got... So what does residents mean? Happiness, my turn. Pop your okay. cake. Okay, we can make them slaves. Thank you, Commonus. Um, I could make them slaves. And I guess it doesn't really matter, right? Because, like, who gives a shit? They're just horrible plant monsters. Shall I enslave them? Do I, do I enslave the, the plant monsters? Should I enslave them? I don't know. I don't know if that's the right right choice. Just not sure. God. God damn it, guys. Get some work done. Jesus Christ. Uh, okay, let's build another one of these. Even though we've got so many minerals that I don't really know what to do with them at the moment. But that's fine. I'll worry about that in a sec. Research station output 10%. Uh, scientist level cap. Sure. We'll see. A sense of putting a number of possible points of interest. Alright, well. Show me something interesting then. Or I'm going to knock your block off. Literally. Okay, I, I don't like this. This like, like this feels good because I've got a nice choke point. That feels this this feels mess. This feels very messy. I and mean, all I can really do is maybe put a defense station there to protect my inner systems. And this is kind of like my I guess you'll be fine space. Uh, and you lose Luca to a giant space jellyfish. I look. There's literally nothing I could do. I did my best. But yes, she was she was strangled to death. Or at least we hope she was strangled to death. With any luck. Okay, I want you to go there. I want that. I want that. And then we'll do more stuff. You, I guess, stay there for the moment. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. Uh, fleet is at full strength. Are we building more Forty-two years and three days. A closer scan of debris field around Jib Vul has led to the discovery of an airtight capsule containing an atomic clock that measures time with unparalleled precision. 
It's a frequency uncertainty so low, blah, blah, another blah, 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 date 42 years and three days away. Keep an eye on it. It's a bomb. Destroy it. Capture is full of innocent looking wires. Anyone which could be rigged or set off a weapon of mass destruction so far they could wipe out the entire galaxy. The crew will slip them all. Seems like that would be a bad idea. Keep an eye on it, I guess. I'm not particularly... I don't, I don't even know where it is. Is it over here? Somewhere? That's fine. Wow, there's a load of gateways. A load of gateways over there. I'll worry about that later. It's on my list of things to worry about. What could possibly go wrong? Time for Luca 2. Oh, that's a good point. We could have Luca 2, couldn't we? Who's taking over the glory initiative? Scientist Potel Up Law. Who? Who the fuck are you? You. Luca the Seconds. Commanding Rocker Downey Jr. Where's Rocker Downey Jr.? That one there. Uh, Luca Mc... Luca Face the second. Perfect. A few... Th ah, it's be fine. Nothing can go wrong. We're all... It, it, it's, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I think I should probably put a station there. Because that way they have to take the station to get to my inner systems. Can they them like disc world trolls? That would be much easier. Well, I could do. Oh, God. God damn it. What the fuck is going on here? This is a this is terrible. This is awful. Difficulty six. I mean, I know it's hard, but but come on, poor Den Pon. You should be better than this. Get some elbow gr grease out, or whatever rocks have for elbow grease. Okay, so this is a little self-contained area over here. Wreckage identified. Crew aboard the era. Uh, who is it? The Grand Galactic Pithok Alliance. We need those minerals. I mean, we don't really need the minerals. Um, and we'll get influence. We'll just give them back. Hey, guys. Some... Okay, what we could do... Right. We did... Hello. Our pleasure. Enjoy. Could we maybe be friends with these guys? It's minus 13. I mean, that's not bad, is it? A little border friction. Could we get a non... Right, non-aggression. How much would we need? Unfriendly attitude. Okay, we could offer trade deal. Um, just give you some minerals. Still unfriendly. I mean, it's not very nice, is it? Try and do something nice for your, for your neighbour. <sighs> do you have... Oh, I don't. You're right. I'd completely forgotten about the tentacle monsters. Um, can you read some research? Who would like to purchase... Purchase... Purchase? I would like to purchase... Please... Please, sir. Sure, whatever that is, do that. What's this? Oh, the gas giant. It's oh, quite a boring one from what I remember. Let's hit recalculate relations. Uh, okay, alien box opened. Here we go. Right. So, box contains three liquid-filled vials. One red, one blue, one green. Uh, for reasons beyond us, there uh, uh, should be enough time to synthesize the play. One of our species confirms the effects will be positive. But entire... Right, so, what do, we do? what do we do? Right, here we go. Red, green, blue. Or we can sell them. We're not going to sell them. That'd be silly. Red, green, blue. I should do like a poll, shouldn't I? But I'm sure it'd be fine. What should we do? What should we do? Null. Nullu. Blue. Okay. Blue. Um, I, th I think each of these does a certain thing, doesn't it? Stop. Hammer time. I'm stopping. I say red. Virus says red. We've got one for blue. Green. Green Kazorks. Okay, that's two for green. Oh, it's, everyone's saying green. Green is best. Is it, though? 
Tapping him says blue. No one's red. It's green or, green or blue. I mean, I, I feel like... I feel like tapping him knows, knows which is the best one. Should we go blue? I'm thinking... Fuck it, blue. Uh, increase our potential lifespan. Limited regeneration traits. Oh. So what does that give us? Uh, species. So we get... Incre oh, uh, no, that's Lithoid. <laughs> uh, army damage 10% and lead lifespan 10 years. So we've already got... So that's 20, so we get 30... Plus 50. So we get... Yeah, we live quite... Nope, I don't. Oh, well. I, I quite I quite like living longer, to be honest. Because I quite like the army damage as well. Because later on, taking some planets can be an absolute pain in the ass. Uh, why is our construction ship down? Oh, because it did it get booted out. Ah. Okay, let's go and grab these. Let's go and do that. Ducky's off to see a game of kicks. Enjoy a game of kicks, Ducky. Um, red one ships go faster? Lakes of living metal. Okay, sure. Can we... Hang on. I'm going gonna, gonna to see... Um, Stellaris red, blue, green. Uh... Red, you get very strong. Green, you get adaptive. Blue, you get venerable. So, I mean, adaptive would have been nerd uh, because we've got the the bat the bowel thing. Red would have been quite useful, but I feel like blue is pretty good. So, I'm I'm happy with that choice. Yeah, green green probably wouldn't have been that useful. So, blue is the right choice. Uh, Destroyer, Ooh, crystal mines. Gas extraction, planet build speed. Let's get planet build speed. Let's do that. They don't give very strong. Oh, do they not? It's this? Yeah, re research it. <gasps> oh, you bastards! You fuckers! Okay, no problem. Oh, I, I, I didn't rise the. A oh, ooh! I didn't think the AI would do that anymore. I've, I've, the Phoenix. Oh, hello, Phoenix Order. Hello. Uh, I represent the Phoenix Order. I'd like to lead a Commissary General, Rish Naladia, believes in peace through strength. Respect our authority. Okay, you're over there. Well met, evil rock lords. Oh, they quite like us. Don't like our slavery policy, but they, they do like aliens. Sexy, stupid, sexy aliens. That's fine. They have their own trait. Great Vulcans. Uh, the final rests. We'll just get some random tech. Sure, why not? Okay, let's grab this bit. Then we'll grab that bit. And hopefully, that's. I mean, well, we can then grab that system. But to be honest, we can't grab anything else because otherwise, the the military isolationists will. Fuck us up. Okay, that's back and available. And we've got uh, more energy credits, which is really useful. Let's get the lasers. Hopefully we should... Do you like me? Unfriendly. No, you still... Okay, well, fuck you then. Basically, suck a dick. Right, I'm gonna declare rivalry. New contact. The Human Confederation. Interesting. Hello, Human Confederation. Uh, respect our authority. Where are they? Gal oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Who are these guys? Oh, they're, they're Federation build. Okay, that's, that's, that, could, that could be worse. Oh, poor humans. Poor, poor... They're a vassal. Yeah, that's not a surprise, to be honest. That's not a surprise. 
The event with the coffin got changed. Now other empires may get pissed at you for opening it. Oh well. What are you going to do? Uh, good. Some, the other, the what system? Oh, that system. Well, tough shit. It's mine now. It's mine now. It's my, my system now, Dev. Oh, yeah, more naval capacity would be useful. Right, what I want to do... New contacts. The Sathid Prime. Hello. Uh, sure. Where are you? Okay, you're over there. You're over there. Don't like you, but you do have a lot of space to expand into, which is bad. It's not the end of the world, but it's bad. Okay, let's go and grab that. The probability conundrum. Uh, sure. Can probably. So you communicate from the previously unknown space wing and the course of the regime of Gorfis. Yep, look, looks like like looks like a Gorfis. You are hegemonic imperialists, and you're over there. New contact the Akano Empire. Slaving despots. Where are you? You're over there. Well, meeting meeting everyone now. Holy shit. Look at that. I think the Federation build it better than having an oppressed client state. They might not be oppressed much. Yeah, I don't think many people are gonna like us to be honest. Luca McLuca face. Yeah, we're gonna start no, we don't want to start digging, do we? Digging would be bad. Okay, let's go and send Luca over here. Right, I do want to colonise this. But I don't want to excavate that yet. We'll do it, do it later. Right, let's start building some bits and pieces. We've also, of course, got a natural wormhole here. So that could be interesting. Uh, let's build, build another thingy, but signs of resistance. Ah, finally. The disturbances of the science ship sense in orbit are nothing compared to the complications encountered down the surface on Ebanor 1. Extreme magnetic fluctuations from some unknown sources making equipment go haywire. It'd be quite an ordeal to research this electromagnetic bedlam, but given enough time, the answers will emerge. Keep digging! Keep digging! Uh, let's get the mineral purification plants here. Because more minerals? Not that I need them, but I'll take it. I can know where I missed. Come on, uh, they're over here. There they are. They're doing okay for themselves. Looks like they're, they're doing fine. They might be next to this hive mind. Yeah, they not a fan of the hive minds, mind you. A lot of the lot of the galaxy doesn't seem to like each other. So I mean, that's that's fun. Literally just a tinder pot waiting to explode. How are we doing here? A little bit of crime. But I think we're okay. Uh, regular signal, sure. Okay, let's grab this one. Then we can't take anything. Oh, I could go, go grab this one. But I think that's quite strong. So we probably don't want to do that just yet. Lost in space. Derelict ship. Uh, where is it? Uh... Nah. Uh, new sector. I could, couldn't I? I could do that. That is true. Uh, planets and sectors. 
is oh, how the fuck do I do this now? I forgot all right, that, that one. No. How do I do this? I've forgotten sectors. On the planet screen. Ah. Not this one. Nope, this one. Is it a decision? Help me, Thyrus. Click on the planet in front here. Nope. Oh, I don't know. How to. It's probably fine. No, it used to be that you just had to make a thing and it was fine. And now I don't know what I'm doing. See the text reading no sector. Ah! Ah ha ha ha! Ah ha 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 ha! Catman Victor! Thanks for follow! Uh, create new sector. Sure. Let's get who's good. That one. Thank you. Hello, hello, and wise man. Oh, one. Oh, thank God. I need some of those. Experience gain. You're only. Oh, you're sixty. That's not very old. You are eighty-five, but you've lived twenty-five years longer. Um, let's get you. Name in asphalt. Is that because he's sticky and hot? Uh, asphalt. Done. Done, done, done. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, so I guess we could have a sector with that planet in it, but I guess we could have these ones as well. Probably what I should have done is actually made, like, waited until I got this one and then put that one because that would have then got. Because now I'm going to have this Diddy, Diddy planet by itself, even though I might not actually colonize that one, so it's probably not a, probably not a concern. Um, perhaps you should assign the new admin to the sector. I thought I did. Oh, no, I didn't. I did not do that. Thank you. I'm a dope. A dope, a dope, 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 a dope. Okay, what I want to do. Now, Grunner down here has a lot of mining districts, but I don't need mining districts at the moment, to be honest. I'm pretty pretty okay so i won't worry too much about that at the moment um oh you don't have anywhere to go everything's been done what's over here why is this fl oh it's because that was that was that thing okay okay this is fine what i'm gonna do is choha over here it's going to be my research world. Science world. That's what we're going to put there. It's like it's a pre-built with map. Oh, yes, of course. They changed it, didn't they? Of course, I remember. Yeah, I remember that. Commercial pacts. The regime of Gorfis. Okay. What about you? Could we not be friends, Zom? We can be friends. Let's be friends, Zom. Um. Have mutual allies. Best friends against the galaxy. It'd be great. Uh, yes, it would matter. Did Wait, because uh, I remember them saying something... Oh, were they going to... Was that an... Oh, they, well, that was an option they were going to do, wasn't it? They said it could be like pre-made sectors, but they... Yeah, it's still there's still four jumps. Yeah, Thyrus, you're right. You are correct. As usual. The best kind of correct. Uh let's get uh have I not built a thing there? I have not. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, you don't have anything left to do. Our science ships has gone as far as they can, in which case I guess. Excavate that. Given that that generation was changed so that there were less of the kind of happenings where there was one or two systems between sectors. Ah. 
Knowledge is still shit. Ah, oh, bless. Alien specimen procurement. Uh, oh, I can't be asked. Massive pain in the ass. Planet build speeds. Excellent. Uh, lithoid. Ooh, what's this? Wait, what's this? Comet sighted. To victory! Oh, so we get more crystals. Oh, it costs more... Like, it's more effective, basically. So, we get six... Six crystals for 30 minerals compared to two for 10. Because we... Oh, they get more translucent jobs. Oh. Huh. Huh. Um, if our crystal plant is there from 2.2, don't know how to build that. Ah. Interesting. Okay, well, let's get more research because I'm, I don't need crystals at the moment. How are we doing over here? We've got someone jobless. We've got plenty of that. Uh, what do I want to do here? What's my plan? I guess just it's like big city planet. Big defences. Big bottom girls, that kind of thing. Uh, let's get some research stations over there. Okay. I mean, I've got these. I'm kind of thinking now, do I actually want this? Because I feel like I was just asking for trouble. I'm kind of happy down here. Like, I've got, I've got my nice little... Like, nice little corridor of systems. I'm fairly happy down here. I could, like, cozy up. It'd be good. Uh, Lithoid crystal box can only be built on unique planetary features. I've never seen it spawn. Oh, okay. Interesting. Mutagen Merchant Guild. Hello. Rami people. Well met. What, what do you do? Uh, so you do crystals. Well, don't need them. Don't need your crystals. Do want lasers, though. Want more reactors. Literally never seen that. Oh, okay. Interesting. Bit of a weird one, then. Wait, what's that? Birth of Galactic Market? Okay. Uh, never done... Reset... What? What? The regime have entered into defensive backed. Oh, that can't be good. This isn't good. Well, there are no more anomalies, so I guess we'll go Polytechnic. So they are making friends. You are rival against the regime of Gorfis. Maybe we can do that as well. And maybe that make happy? Like... Maybe we can stop being... Maybe if I give you minerals? Because I've got so many minerals, I literally don't know what to do with them. So, like, have 2k. Lock yourself out. All yours, buddy. I think we need to be friends, Zom. Let's be friends. Come on, Zom. Stop. Don't... Right. Stop being... Don't be rivals with me. Stop being a rival. <sighs> Some. Okay, they declare right. Fine. Fuck, Gu guys. H horse guys, come on, guys. And we're all Stellaris nerds. How interesting. Maybe it just doesn't spawn. Maybe it is broken. Okay, how are we doing? Uh, okay. Okay, fine, fine. <laughs> fine, no problem. No problem, right. Shit. Uh, okay, this is fine. It's 1.3k, we're fine. This is fine. Come on, hurry up. Upgrade! <laughs> 
It is fine. Everything is fine. No problems. Don't worry about life. Uh, look at this little Christmas isn't even listed as a building. More alloys? Yes, more alloys would be a good shout. Um, I'm just going to humiliate them. Right, need space. No, come on. Come on, guys. You ready? Go, go, go. It's go, go. Don't just go. If I need more, I'll build more. Oh, why does everyone always declare war on me before I'm ready? Because I never build a fleet. I'm so bad at this game. So bad. Yeah, I need more minerals. Uh, more alloys, even. Yep, 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 yep. An archaeology chain. Ah, interesting. Interesting. Uh, right. I think if we can get the fleet here, we're probably okay. He says. Yeah, we're probably right. I think we're fine. I think we're fine. We'll be fine. No worries, anyone. This is okay. Migration treaty. Okay, good. Come on, dickheads. Stop rivaling me. We can be friends. Stupid horse people. All right, we can just we can just bop them. How much? Two. Oh god, they're two k. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, well that that's fine. That's fine. Okay, get them, boys. Worst case, everyone dies. That's worst case. That is absolute. That is absolute worst case. Pop growth speed. Um, yeah, I mean that could come in useful. That could come in useful. Uh, remember when I made fun of your fleet and you defended it and said it was great? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Fine. At least we've got a new colony. You know, so not everything's bad. Stop bombarding my planet, you bastards. I probably shouldn't be playing this on, on Grand Admiral difficulty, considering I haven't played this in, like, fucking months. It's fine. 1.1 1 .1 against 1.9. See, that was all right. Apart from, obviously, we all died. Apart from that, that was fine. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. See, we only lost half their number. That was okay. That was fine. What is... What? Right. So evil rock lords are forced to adopt the ethos and government of form of a galactic pithoc alliance. What would that be, exactly? Out of interest. Federation... Oh, I'd have to be egalitarian and like aliens. Are you fucking kidding me? Everyone would be miserable. <laughs> oh, no! I mean, I mean, it's fine. It's fine. Market. Could I? Right. I could sell. To be honest, I should be doing this. Right. Sell some of that. Um. Yeah, I I know. I'm getting around to it. Don't worry. Just chill. Chill. 
Uh, I'm not interested this time. Sorry, tentacle monsters. I'm just kind of, I'm in the middle of something. Middle of the whole thing. We'll become humble rock. No! God, no. Fuck that. Sodding hell, no. Uh, right. It's fine. We just we just rebuild. We can rebuild. We can rebuild. Fully repaired. See, this is going fine. This is fine. Even you aren't very good. I know. I'm terrible at games. I literally. Oh no! I don't. I don't want to be. I don't want to be democratic. Can you imagine democratic evil rock lords? Hello, we're the evil rock lords. Yes, we are democratic. That's correct. Yes. Strange story. We were actually conquered by Democrats, and uh, they made us be democratic, even though we are still, of course, massively fucking evil. <laughs> Pretty good. Don't worry, though. Oh. It's true, but it hurts. Just saying. Well, just saying. Okay, making our stands at Keed. Uh. This is fine. This is fine. We got this. No worries. They're just conquering all my space, but apart from that... Oh good. Stimis, apparently. I don't even know where that is. I don't care. I'm kind of busy at the moment. Kind of, kind of locked into something here. What do they have? They've just got red... They're just fucking picket ships. Not you. Can, we can do this, boys. We got this. How many of them are there? Ugh. Um. Uh, um what, how, what, what, how, 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 how many are there? Can I see how many ships they have? Like, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. They can't have that many. Right, can you just, like, stay fucked off for, like, 50, 40, 50... Come on, hurry up. Hurry up. It's better than nothing. An odd factor. I'll worry about that in a bit. Perfect. Okay, this is slightly more even. Or not. Nope, getting them ass kicked. How were they doing so much damage? Like, they've got small red lasers. And I've got blue lasers and ultraviolet lasers. Do they have better shields? They've got better armor. And lasers are good against armor. So I don't quite like understand how they're doing so much more damage. Sentinel point of oh. I mean that's not is that is it? I have more shields. I mean 65 compared to 100. I guess they do. But my armor's better. Well, I guess they've got more... Uh, yeah, I guess, I guess, I guess, I guess at this point maybe that is... Okay, well, I, I guess we're becoming the democratic... Um... Yeah. The worst possible outcome... Well, apparently we're the democratic 
We eat the Democrat. <laughs> we got <laughs> fucking hell. <sighs> Great. Great! <laughs> the evil rock republic. I mean, no, I mean, look at this. The, the scientist Luca, I mean, actually, she's not that upset. She's just a bit like, meh. Whereas scientist Hematal Gun is absolutely fucking fuming. He's furious. What is, uh, how do we see, how do we see happy people? Um, yeah, they're not happy, are they? Is it population? Happiness. I mean, they're actually not that, they're not that upset about it, I guess. They're kind of okay. They're like, well, okay. Make them happy with rock music. Might have to be done. Well, that was a kick in the nuts, wasn't it? That was a kick in the nuts. Holy shit. Good. Good. Well, that, that was fine. Oh, I may as well downgrade you. There's no point having a station there. Well. Well. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, if I, I, hang on. I just need to check because they might not have... Um... Oh. 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 N mm. Now they want... Uh, uh, I, is it going to take a turn for everyone to get really shitty? Now we can be friends. Fucking dicks. Suits our needs. I mean, I might as well have some friends, I guess. Let me guess. You hate me now? Um. Oh, am I so pathetic that you can't rival me anymore? Well, I guess that's something. Good. 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 <sighs> Just be really evil Democrats. Uh... Okay, well. Let's get a foundry, I guess. And how many? Okay, we've got two unemployed people there. Uh, let's get how? What's unemployed? New bowl. Okay, well let's let's build one of those. One of those. And Jula, we're going to upgrade you. And seeing as we now border our allies, there's no point building defenses here because they're unlikely to attack us again. Considering we're now. You know exactly what they fucking want us to be. Um, with that in mind, I guess maybe go for. Could get commercial zone. You know what? Let's go. Let's go Unity. Let's do that. Rock bureaucrats. Evil rock uh, Democrats. Like. You know, we can have elections, but we do it really evilly. Or something. No, you can fucking insects go and bureaucrat. Oh, fucking yeah. Bureaucrats. Evil rock bureaucrats. Done. Well, uh, do this, uh, does this still work? So we've got warrior culture and cutthroat, but I think that's still fine, even though we're not militaristic anymore. So theoretically, we shouldn't be able to have that, but I think it's okay. I think. Do we get the hollow theatres? Oh, no, we don't get it. Maybe we can't use it. The Zom said, oh, screw you, Zom. Got so much more on my plate than your dickishness. 
is that saying it? Is that... Oh. Inactive warrior culture. Yeah, I'm with you. I'm with you. Okay. Uh, okay, well, we'll get rid of you. And... I mean, there's nothing more evil than a really, like, like, we, we, yeah, all right, we can't be outwardly evil anymore, okay? We can't be outwardly evil. What we're going to do is it's going to be just shit tons of forms to fill out. So every time someone comes in and they're like, okay, I'd, I'd like to, um, I'd like to, uh, I'd, I'd like to have a parking space. They give you a form. That form then leads you on to someone other department, which then you have to fill out another form and then fill out another form. Basically, it's just really evil bureaucracy. Wait, 19 years? Oh, son of a... Okay. Okay, well, on that bombshell, my wife has just uh, returned, so I'm going to go and make some lunch. And Thyrus has to leave anyway. More than not... I mean, yeah, basically everyone's just being really dickish. They can't be outwardly evil. We're just going to be really kind of obnoxious to each other now. Just, just because. Just because. But unfortunately, that's where I'm going to have to end the stream for today. Um, I'll be back on... Monday? Yes, Monday at around 10 o'clock-ish um, with some Total War. But I'd like to play Solaris again. Maybe I'll play Solaris next next weekend. Next Saturday. Do another one. Something like that. Lunch? Now? I mean, it's 1 o'clock, so here. And I'm hungry. Way too late. Well, normally I have, I have it at midday, but my wife was out, so I'm going to go and sort that out. Here too. Ah, oh, same here. Okay, well... I'm going to get some lunch because I'm, I'm, I've got a hunger on. So I'm going to do that. So until until Monday, thank you very much for watching. And I will continue the Evil Rock Bureaucrats next weekend. So until then, thank you very much for watching. And have a good weekend.